not for the weak. World, are y'all ready? You know what's up when this sound begin. We about to go in. Let's do it. Let's do it. Yeah. seen no show like this cracking jokes and singing we won't miss 5150 up in this bitch yeah. you ain't never seen a show like this ghetto folks gonna be all in their bliss trying to make you laugh until you kiss yeah. You ain't never seen no show like this, yeah. 5150, 2022, it's on. I'm about to say some real things. Rip the mic and bring the pain. Cause you ain't never seen no show like this. Motherfucking Ryan is back in the motherfucking house. Damn, All man. you bitch ass niggas. <laughs> Ryan, what's up with you? I cool, swear we don't like bitch each other, niggas. man. No, but they manipulate the weak. Yeah. We'll talk about that in a second. We got my man Marcus in this motherfucker. You know Marcus. And we got the extra blessing, motherfucking Craig. 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 In this bitch. Yes. We about to talk this shit, man. Well, I, well, let's let's go for the motherfucking first thing first. Ryan, I'm glad you're back, bro. Man, man, thanks for having me back, man. They man. said so. What, you, can we talk about you, you moving and shit? Yeah. Hey, you're not you not living out here no nah, more. Nah, man, I'm back in North Carolina, yo. What? Okay, so look, you know you know this fifty one fifty. Where your roommate go, nigga? <laughs> <laughs> You know niggas, <laughs> niggas is waiting on that. Hey, nigga. Where the I nigga at? You, I, love, I love 5150 Nation. Cause nigga, <laughs> it don't matter what I'm doing, anything. They be like, Ryan nominated for NAACP award. They be like, it's his roommate going to be his right, yeah. his show. I be like, God damn, nigga. Y'all but you was in New York. Me. Didn't they come see you? Yeah, but 5150 always show up, nigga. Nice. Always. Nice. Nigga. Always. Nice. And they be like, get your ass back up there and get on the show with Corey. Good, and, yeah. and I was like, me and Corey, good. We just, I'm just not on that side of the map. I was like, as soon as I get back, I'm going to reach out. And when I know did Corey. That happen? Yeah, what? man, I had moved. Uh, near the end of last year, like oh. like late October or November, oh, I moved man. over there. Mm. I just didn't say nothing, man. You didn't like why, why, why did why you know the Midnight oh, Train, the Georgia it's song? It's for the kids, man. My, <laughs> kids, my kids. You got oh. kids? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You be in your kids' life? I'm trying. Oh. I, 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 what? But now I am, yeah. man. That's the thing. <laughs> Yeah, my daughter turned seven. I was like, nah, she I gonna start remembering yeah. shit. She yeah. can see you on the yeah. internet. Yeah. Oh. Have a Zoom meeting with your kids once a week. Hey, I, it's, it's the new world. Did it fall? Did it fall, the mic? Oh, yeah. Oh. You yeah. Put it, uh -huh. Is that cock blocking the mic? Nah, nah. nah. <laughs> <laughs> we'll do it this way. I ain't want it. Uh, somebody, somebody said Corey dressed like a pack of uh, mumble fruit juice. <laughs> <laughs> I got on my oh, colorful yeah. shit. Oh, yeah. No, nah, look, look, Ryan. It's always, look, this is some real shit. It's always going to be drama from the internet world if they can get to you. Yeah. yeah. They would love Some people that. love to get to your head. I didn't have niggas call me, hey man, Corey, why you say this about me? I'm like, huh. what I say? I said, <laughs> well, did you see it? Yeah. No, but they said you said it. I be like, get your garbage ass the fuck away from me, nigga. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? They try that shit. I'll watch it. 
And I was like, that ain't nothing Corey wouldn't say. If I, I joke about it. Right look, he nigga. it all the time. When you said you had the the the, 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 the roommate and I saw he was a light-skinned nigga, uh. he looked like a uh, Craig who don't work out. Yeah. <laughs> you talking about Austin. Yeah, you talking about Austin. Yeah. <laughs> who I love as well. He that, was that, right. That nigga I, good. He great. love everybody. No, he nah, was that nigga good. Nice. Come on. That he ain't going to tell you she don't like you unless it's I off sure camera. Would. But that I wouldn't be mean. I would just say stage, he man. is. Thank you. I went yeah, to their show. Some motherfucker here. said, "Show my sneaks." Fuck it. Oh, yeah, can I you like see those. him? Yeah. Supreme. That nigga. Boy, he don't spend nigga. no expense on his. Nigga look like a wealthy I'm a, I'm a, I'm a trick, uh, Jamaican nigga. drug dealer. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody say I'm late because they on time. I feel you, my dude. <laughs> Somebody said Ryan right. killed it in Philly. That's yeah. right. Yeah. See. I look nah, like this a tour to go to for sure. Yeah. Yeah. I'm. Corey went the LGBT shit. This LGBT shit. No. 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 You know, right That's cross colors. No, That's cross colors. That's toddler shit. Rubens Cube. Rubens Cube dressing ass. That's because yes, you booked that Bugsy right. Seagulls 2 movie with them <laughs> outfits you be wearing, nigga. He got the shit. <laughs> yeah, see? Yeah. yeah. Coppers. <laughs> Coppers. <laughs> <laughs> Dick Tracy movie. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> it's a it's an envy Dick thing Tracy. out here, man. <laughs> that uh oh shit, hold on. This might be my motherfucking wife. <laughs> oh no, it's my mom. Oh. She tell you to take that shit off. Mama. <laughs> you know I'm doing the show. <laughs> you know I'm doing the show. <laughs> no, I'm gonna call you after this. Love you, mom. I about to talk about these bitches. Oh. Uh, oh my God. That nigga hung that phone up. Don't believe him. <laughs> no, he wasn't. Hung it. He was not. Damn it. it was, my mama don't like that shit. Why do you say <laughs> all that stuff? <laughs> and I get a whole wop. She be like, well, you got to do what you got to do. <laughs> the game is cold out here. Oh, that's my mama got at me about that shit I was talking the other day. <gasps> no. Uh, not uh, about her, about your... Your my, dad. My dad oh his, my God! Come his side it. chick. Yeah. Oh, y'all remember when I said uh, she used to give us money? Yeah. yeah. My mom was like, "Bitch, you used to give us money too. Give me money too." <laughs> <laughs> y'all got me <laughs> fucked up, nigga. <laughs> I come from the game. <laughs> Nigga, do six six out state. Bob twelve oh eight. Robert Taylor home. Nigga, know about that shit from the crib. Nigga, know about that from every ghetto around the country, dog. Mm -hmm. I got ghetto. Yeah, I got a real home. ghetto address from my past. Some niggas be saying they, but they ain't got no ghetto address. Fifty two six six South State. Bob twelve oh eight. Robert Taylor home. Now thirty six fifteen South Federal. Stay with God. Anybody got a real ghetto address up here they can call out? Well, Vadio. Ghetto neighborhood. Vadio. Ghetto neighborhood. John Burrow. Where is that? Yeah, John Burrow. Oh, this is, this is Little Rock. Right, what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, niggas, niggas recognize it from Little Rock. Uh -huh. yeah. You come from the hood, nigga. Mm -hmm. What's the address? You still live there, nigga? That's no, fucked man. up. He's <laughs> <laughs> stupid. Nah, I was in the apartment. You was in the apartment? Yeah, 24 and 24, the bed mountain drive. All right, Little Rock, y'all got to validate mine. if that's hood. Might oh, be some safe shit. That was in Twin Lakes. That was what? That was in Twin Lakes. Them niggas, them niggas retarded. No, you niggas said retarded. 12 Lakes? Twin Lakes. Twin Lakes. Uh, you yeah. said 12 Lakes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. 12, when you put effort into it, you was able to come up with twin. <laughs> <laughs> My nigga. Mine was 219 South Bell Street in Corona, California. Near 3rd, if anybody knows where that park is. Just saying. That's who it's shit? It's Vario. Vario? Mm-hmm. Oh, I can't do it. My parents you still there. I didn't move them out. You didn't move them out? No, a lot of motherfuckers be, hey man, well, I, 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 how many of y'all ever been over somebody's house and they, they parent be over there and they be like, well, you know, I had to let my mama move in. Motherfucker, they be living with their mama. They're on yeah. right. You be like, nigga, you, you yeah. disrespect your mom like that. Uh -huh. I've been fucking your mom for years. Oh, nigga, wow. like this. <laughs> anyway, no, I'm just saying, man. Uh, we, got a, we got something I want to bring up. It's a word, uh, envy. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. This envy word is something that we must really elaborate on because envy really should be a class in college where people learn to control it. Because what I have found, envy goes unchecked 
until a fight happens. Most of the time. Mm -hmm. Right. A fight happens by the time motherfucker do something about envy. It, it ends up in fist of cups. That's real mm -hmm. shit. How can we deal with envy in a way where if we talk about it on this show today, it might actually help somebody who motherfucking don't even know where to begin? Because, see, I, I get envy from everywhere. But right. go ahead, Craig. Get, elaborate. What? We have to provide an environment where it's comfortable for the envious to state that I'm envious and not be looked at as being a hater. Mm. You know what I mean? If, mm -hmm. if you knew that early, like you'll tell a motherfucker I'm hungry when you're hungry, and envy to me is a form of hunger because it's really your, 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 your mind telling you I want to consume something that I can't get yet. You know what I'm saying? So we need yeah, to make it comfortable. Yeah, that's the key word you just said. Yeah, we need to make but it. We, I don't think we being realistic yeah. if we say yet. There are some On people some who watch other people and they know they'll never get there. And they don't know how to deal with it. Right. What do we do with the weaklings? <laughs> like, look, let me check, check this out. Everybody can't be on this show. I get niggas who I like. I'm talking about niggas I like. Corey, nigga put me on the motherfucking show, nigga. Uh -oh, nigga in the field. And I be like. <laughs> who is it? Oh, shit, nigga. <laughs> then these niggas. Who, I, one nigga who called me, this nigga used to have a show in Hollywood. He got into a fight at his show in Hollywood. <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> but I love the niggas, you know what I'm saying? But it's you like. You talking about Zoe? No, oh, hell well, no. Zoe <laughs> so, 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 so was an asset to the 5150 <laughs> show all day long. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Except for. Uh, when um, Freeze took that hat off that day, <laughs> that, I had. He, 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 I think the reason Zoe was mad that day because he had let it grow out a little, so you could really see the part to grow in. You can see how and it no go. One was expecting that. I still remember that episode. Yeah, he was, he was so bad. I ain't never seen Zoe eyes buck like that. Yeah, Zoe said he was bad. Nigga, <laughs> that hair. I don't know his hair. It, it never come out straight. <laughs> when it come out like the lip part, it still be like this. <laughs> <laughs> so his, 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 hair, his hair is like when you in the bed rolling and shit or something. <laughs> and it's missing but up here. But anybody would have reacted like that if you didn't expect something that you were covering. It's like if somebody were covering something up. We all know Freeze ain't do that shit to try oh, to be purpose. disrespectful. Exactly. Freeze just a silly motherfucker just like the rest of us, but I'm just saying. Uh, getting back on the envy part of the whole thing I and like shit. I like what he said about it, too. About what? Creating a space where they can just admit it and don't have to feel bad Mad about, about it. it. That's the thing. That's the thing, because they'll the hide section. it. Yeah. But it's okay to say you can't achieve that. There are people out here who will talk like they just like you on your main lick. Like, it's girls out here, body banging. And you, what you gonna tell an irregular built bitch? Right. <laughs> what, what are you gonna tell her? Mm. Just keep. Um, <laughs> but they try to make us feel bad if for you, liking it. Right. <laughs> they be like, oh, you ended up perfect body bitches. Right. Of course. <laughs> what are you talking about? You're right. Or, what yeah. am I supposed to be into? But that's what I'm saying. This is all, this is all like, if you put a group of women who are not attractive, around a group of women who are attractive, the envy is going to be obvious. If you put a group of girls who um, do hair good around the bitches who don't do hair good. I know if, I know somebody who does um, the, um, what is the shit, the um, shit, exercise people the do? Mm -hmm. uh, trainer? What is that shit, what is that form of exercise where they be dancing? Zumba. Zumba. Uh -huh. I know a girl who does Zumba real good. So when she goes to the Zumba, all the bitches in Zumba don't like her because she keep up with the instructor. Like, this is real shit that happens every day, and we don't know how to respond to people. We all just look it off and just do this and shit. But I think there needs to be college classes made to help people deal with envy in the world because envy is the reason a lot of this shit fucked up out here. Man, the phone need therapy. You need what? Therapy. Therapy? Therapy? Why they need oh, third yeah. flu? Yeah, but if you didn't have a... If you didn't have a... <laughs> oh, said they need to piss three times, <laughs> nigga. Um, so your throat sore, nigga, you're envious. <laughs> you say third P. You're talking about something that would normally... Uh, Diabetic night. <laughs> normally a good parent would instill in somebody. So when that's missing, that goes to show you how bad it is out there then if 
if no, even if you a parent, you have you can't just. This is some real shit. Listen, I don't know. My dad taught me well. When I brought my girlfriend over with my little niece, who always happy and play with me and everything, when she saw my girlfriend and she was a little girl, she was like. That's when you're supposed to just no, whip like, in the butt and teach him something. What? Like, it's a little mm-hmm. hater bitch. <laughs> <laughs> That's like kids do the same thing. You're right. Like, right, it's my kid. niece. I'm like, kid. this bitch is a born hater. <laughs> she always smiling when she get me to herself. Because when I come over, I pick her up, play with her. But when she saw me with my girl, she was like. <laughs> See, and like, instantly oh, you're supposed to, little, you're supposed so to told her I'm something. saying, like, I <laughs> feel like I know she's still a hater, bitch, because ain't nobody help her. I uh, wasn't around her. Uh, maybe I could have helped her deal with because, you know, my, my niece, it don't matter what she do, she ain't going to look like a bitch who get chose out here. I'm just saying. Uh, so. I don't know. She's about twenty something now. Oh, okay, baby. Marcus. Uh huh. <laughs> 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 I ain't saying she ugly. I'm just saying she built in a way where she ain't gonna get chose until they sweeping at the club. <laughs> <laughs> if she's still there when she's sweeping, the janitor gonna be at that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> so, what? And, that, and that's Did probably you? why she acts that way. <laughs> She's not secure. What? But I'm saying, like, we what we we walking out here in the world, we acting like and the worst envy is the niggas. Mm-hmm. Oh man. What if what what do you do with an envious nigga, goddammit? Get away. Yeah. What? Yeah. Get away. That's the best Got thing to. to do. Get away. Because eventually but he's gonna he's it like sometimes like I've seen women be like jealous. I, uh, you be talking to a woman and somebody fine walk by and she say some shit like, she can't even walk in them hills. I'm like, oh. that ain't got nothing to do with our conversation <laughs> right. we were having. Mm-hmm. But I've had a dude jealous of me and this nigga. Wait, a nigga was jealous of you? That yeah, nigga man. was crazy. Yeah, I, I, hate, I hate both of you collectively. <laughs> <laughs> I hate both of you collectively. But he was jealous, he was more jealous of my career. Because mm. the dude, he had, like, as far as appearance and cares, like, charisma and everything, he had that. Women loved him everything, but he didn't have the career. And this nigga, this wild nigga went, and my, the mother of my children DMs and started saying sucker shit. Trying to well, they always come at your bitch. Home. 50 yeah. Cent got Rick Ross bitch to get in the car and go That's to the mall true. and yeah, everything. You know what I'm saying? Niggas gonna go, oh, well, you think some motherfuckers ain't called my wife? Motherfuckers be trying to, niggas is... Extraordinary haters, and I think I know who the nigga is. I ain't gonna say shit till I confirm it. You know what? Your wife? A nigga called my wife. Jesus Mm. Christ. And I think it's a nigga everybody know. And I ain't said nothing because I I, I ain't got time for that shit. Mm. Like, me and my wife ain't around each other like that. So I'm like, okay. Let that shit go. But if I confirm this is the bitch ass nigga who I think it is, Mm-mm. I'm gonna have slap shit out of the I knew you were gonna say it. On principle, so on principle, yeah. I was like, he gotta, he gotta slap this huh? nigga. Let me do it for you. Oh, yeah, there you go. <laughs> no, hire, I gotta uh, hire me as a security guard for the night and send me to the dick. Yeah. No, see what happens like in, in situations when people see weakness. Like, that's another thing. Uh, we, we talk about having a weak person around you. But when people see weakness, they thrash on it. You know what I'm saying? See, mm-hmm. can't nobody call me about nobody that's around me. Because the first thing I'm going to be like is, why the fuck are you asking me about this motherfucker? That's what I do. Like, some motherfucker call me for niggas' phone number. First thing I say, look, man, I'm going to tell them you looking for them and <laughs> get them your number. <laughs> yeah. And then they get mad. I'm like, motherfucker, I'm not gonna give you no yeah. motherfucking number. Can't that ain't do that how anyway. I do. Can't, nobody right. can. They Marcus shouldn't. ain't never gave nobody my number. Somebody yeah. asked yeah. me your number? Yeah, there we go. Yeah. There. Niggas always ask. I call. I call. Those niggas, they won't I, I, I just, niggas all, the motherfuckers always ask. That's what I do. I call, I call y'all first. Hey, man. But would you want do, your number, man? Don't he call don't, me. He don't never give it. Don't call yeah. me. Yeah. I don't want you to miss out on no opportunity. Yeah, that's There's what I'm saying. There's no opportunities out here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if a nigga trying to get in touch with you, he finna ask for something. Yeah. If it's an opportunity, that nigga gonna get in touch with you. 
When niggas be like, hey, give me that nigga Corey number. Be like, Corey said he don't want you to have his number. Yeah. Just say it. I don't care who it is. Because yeah. if it's a nigga who I fuck with. Then Corey, that's when that envy gonna come out. Nigga, you just say it. Nigga, you ain't even asked it. Right. But I'm saying, just tell him, Corey told me to tell you <laughs> before you asked me. <laughs> he don't feel like talking to you. What the <laughs> fuck I'm gonna talk to a nigga for? I don't know. Right. If it's really about some money or something, goddammit. He gonna get in touch with me or the people we need to get in touch with. Right. If it's a friend of mine, if if if, if you say his name, I'ma know already. Cause I ain't got friends. It be niggas talking about they my friends. I be laughing. Nigga, I, I got four or five friends. Mm -hmm. I ain't got no whole bunch of friends. This niggas on the internet. That's my friend. <laughs> Bitch, nigga, I don't know you. Wait, wait. <laughs> Who the fuck is you, nigga? I don't know you, nigga. You a weirdo. <laughs> niggas who hold that friendship badge up, watch them niggas. Yeah. Who the fuck is your friend? I ain't got no friend. Darlene got a lot of friends. There are certain types. I already broke that down to you. Yeah, types of friends. Yeah, it's yeah. not just. Friends. This is very That's interesting, it. though. Can you? Can you, do you want to elaborate on? Well, that? yeah, because you could say a lot of times when I describe uh, describe somebody, I'll say, "That's my close friend. That's my best friend." That's my associate, or that I know them well. I'll be careful and say, oh, I know them well. You won't catch me saying, oh, I'm friends with that person, and then they say, what is this and that about them? Oh, I don't know. So well, how you, how you describe me, Darlene? What are you supposed to ask me what I am? <laughs> I know you. And yeah, <laughs> I know Ryan. I know Ryan well, and I like him. That's yeah. like I say, I know Ryan, uh, Ryan and I Marcus well, and I like him. I using the word friend so much, too, man. You got to learn new words, acquaintance. Acquaint well, uh, that's like, why I say well, I know niggas, them well. Part of, yeah. A lot of niggas that mm -hmm. you know are called contacts. Those are contacts. That's a good one, too. And, you, and, I know and they can be good or bad contacts. Yeah, that's I know. true. Contacts. Yeah. A friend is elite. Yeah. It's very rare. A friend is somebody you might call on when you fucked up. And if you a motherfucking nigga who stand on yours, you really don't call people when you fucked up. Mm -hmm. You call people just to check on them. Mm -hmm. hey, man, <laughs> please say that shit again. Man, look, yeah. if a nigga when in that phone ring, you feel it. <laughs> oh, here go this nigga. Mm -hmm. He wants something. Okay. Yeah. What the fuck this nigga want? You know I don't fuck with him any day. I got love for him, though. Mm -hmm. You know you have love for a nigga. Right, right. You, can, you can have love for contacts where you wish them well. You don't want nothing to happen to them. But you a contact, nigga. Now you found my number. What you want? Hey, I, you been all right, though? Get the fuck out of here with the boys, dick. Yeah, I hate so small why talk. Why are you calling me, nigga? Yeah, I'm going to ask you what if they, you don't like small talk, you want to get straight to it? If I don't be with you, or, or it ain't like that, like, what are we talking about? See, this is what happens on the phone. Mm -hmm. On the phone, once you get to conversating, sometimes you get to gossiping. Right. And before you know it, you be to put your foot in your mouth and said something in response to something you heard the other person say, but that other person gonna go tell them that shit, and next thing you know, you in the middle of some bullshit because mm. you fucking with niggas you shouldn't even be fucking with anyway. Because you said something in the context that you can only say to your friend. Yeah. That's where the shit get, where envy come from, when you get too comfortable with a motherfucker. Mm -hmm. And, and how you really think. Your friends is really supposed to be the only ones that know how you really feel about shit. Yeah. And, and, and the moves guessing. you making. Mm -hmm. yeah. Your friends should be the only ones who know what moves you making. But it takes take a high level of emotional intelligence because we do things for convenience. Sometimes we hang with people when we lonely or fuck around with people that really ain't up to the caliber, but we just ain't got shit else going on. I used to do that. Yeah. Now I be by myself. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I understand that my friendship circle is very small. Tight. Yeah, yeah. You know tight, what I'm yeah, saying? Tighten it up. And I know I'm a weirdo. I'm a fucking weirdo, nigga. I'm fucking strict at the fucking uh, <laughs> swamp, nigga. Like, get away, donkey. I want to be by myself. That's, that's me, nigga. I don't, I don't. Look, nigga, I love to hang with niggas that I feel like are real thorough ass niggas. And when I say real thorough ass niggas, I mean niggas that I feel like ain't insecure, which is the number one thing that you can't be when you a man. If you Anybody if I'm hanging with a man insecure, and a nigga you can't insecure, be insecure, man, I'd be like, oh shit, this mm -hmm. is like having a motherfucking drama motherfucking queen, which yeah. this insecurity is gonna cause problems. You ever be at the club with an insecure nigga? 
Before you know it, he's like, hey, come on, man. This nigga talking shit over here. You know oh, what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that, man. This nigga talk about my chain. Oh, uh, <laughs> like, shit. What, what the fuck uh, am I doing with this I know nigga? a few niggas like that. Right. Uh, you can't be with, as you get older and you get more responsibility, you're going to branch out from people who you know are not secure as, as men. You just can't hang with an insecure nigga because even the shit they say just out their mouth sometimes. You be like, mm. you can't even say that. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think men too can give compliments. They can't big up and give compliments to other men very easily or very it's much. It's easy to do to your friends. There you go, to your yeah, friends. My but somebody else, they might hate on it. Your, instead yeah. of complimenting something you like, they'll hate on it instead. It's, it's just, Like when Corey put his shoe up, I'll be like, man, Corey. And I said it, Corey's shoe, yep. Corey's shoe game is crazy. Right. Somebody you else will hate me like But somebody else will be like, man, that, they'll be like, oh, that nigga, man, mm -hmm. that shit don't even go with whatever, nigga. Mm -hmm. Them Supremes is crazy. Yeah, but that hoodie ain't shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid. Why don't you put your shoe up? I don't want the shoes fit like wallets. Like wallets? He got karate shoe uh, material on top of his wood grain at Thank the bottom. You. Get your Rubik's Cube dress bands up out of here. nigga said God. Corey dressed like another bad creation <laughs> at the playground. No, somebody said he was an Uno dick. Oh, a nigga did say that. Oh, like no. Uno Uno that. Yeah. Somebody said the Mucinex man over Ryan Child support. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, they don't call me everything. Oh, they don't call me everything under the sun in that motherfucker. Oh god. I hate I hate when they say that because it is like I remember the first time they said that Musin X Man. I was like, man, fuck that. And then I saw the commercial, I was like, God damn. Yeah. So god damn. Nigga stole your shape. And nigga, I'm gonna say just like that nigga, bro. Fuck them niggas. Tell them niggas you got the number. No, <laughs> nigga. Ryan look like a baby bear. Ah, nigga. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> that's fucked up. Oh, the black bro. <laughs> hey man, when it's true, it ain't funny. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> no, but it's like it, it, it's like when you talk about like the only people who get a pass from being talked about really are people who are um, obviously retarded. Have you noticed that? Who, people that what? People who are retarded. It's like if we talk about them, the whole world look at us like we evil. Oh. But them the main people that you be like, look at this motherfucker. Right. <laughs> when I see a nigga, <laughs> I be wanting oh, to joke with him. Oh, man. Oh, my God. I, I, you know what? Yeah, no, I, I used to fuck with him when we was in school. I used to want to walk up to him. <laughs> no, no, I used to oh fuck with them. They, they liked that. When I was when I was in school, I used to fuck with them. They liked that shit, man. Do they? Yeah, cause really? They, cause, no, because you're giving them contact. They yeah. And they know, they, they know what you're saying. Nobody talk to them. Right. Right. They know, know what you're saying. When you say, yeah. Yeah. they're like, Ugh. Oh, my God. He's trying to communicate <laughs> with you, Corey. Jesus. Like, fuck yeah. <laughs> <laughs> say, yeah. They try to my book be like, church. <laughs> nah, nah, for real. I, I, I believe well, Marcus. Like he had a to believe they, in what? The I, be I believe that they really they fuck like with it. that man. If if anybody know, it's the nigga that was in their class. Oh. <laughs> I, I, knew oh, I, knew, I knew he was getting. I knew he was, was getting. I knew he was getting. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Press the easy button. Damn it! Bad fucker. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, that's what we at. <laughs> that almost sound personal. That ain't even a joke. Marcus about to go steal a horse. <laughs> yeah. Marcus, what? Look like you about to go steal a horse. That nigga. You robbed a GMC, dude. As soon as that nigga Marcus got out of his car, that Django oh. music came on. <laughs> I'm not afraid to do the Lord's work. <laughs> Get your motherfucking ass up out of here, nigga. <laughs> So, what about this phrase? I saw this on the internet. I be looking at some of this shit. I be like, this is really some deep shit. Mm -mm. Too many people accept authority as truth instead of truth as authority. Mm. That's yeah. shit. Right that's some deep that's shit heavy. right there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, hey nigga, look, let me tell you something, man. These motherfuckers actually think, I'm talking about the worker bee motherfuckers. Right. I ain't mad at worker bee motherfuckers because we got to do what it's we got to do out here in the game. But if a nigga got to wear a mask all day at work, that nigga is not letting you come in that store without putting on your mask. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Yep. 
He's gonna I'm follow protocol. Kidding. Yeah, he's gonna Every follow by the Every nigga at the Cheesecake Factory working be like, hey, you need a mask to come in here. I love to be like, y'all got masks? They be like, yeah. <laughs> 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 I would have shit out your ass. Then I wear the mask to the table and take it off. I'll be like, nah. <laughs> no, I hear you up and run to my seat. Like, what you say? Right. <laughs> What's the dumbest shit in the world? I bet you wearing a mask as you're walking around public, yeah. when until you, get you to sit the down. Table, you can take it off. But the way the cake take your ears off, that's why I love it. Like, I say, huh, about like eight big, times on purpose. Huh? That's like a bitch telling you, you got to start off wearing a cone. You can take it off when you get started, though. Right. <laughs> you know who's on the drip? Huh? Who's on the drip? <laughs> <laughs> nigga, a nigga. It's easy. It's I don't mind it. I like it. <laughs> nigga, a nigga in New York told on me what in the say? hotel. In the hotel, turned to the. Nah, I came down. The elevator to get uh, to get my photographer, and I rushed. I didn't want to uh, yeah. grab the mask. Mm -hmm. I was just running down. Came off the elevator. A grown ass man was like, oh, oh, "He's not wearing what a mask." To the concierge at the desk, nigga, he was telling this woman. He was telling on me to the lady in the front desk in, in New York. In New York. In New York got that crazy man shit too. It yeah, it was, they mandates were oh, strict. Come yeah, on. Like, he was, he he was like, "Oh." Oh, he's not wearing. I was like, man, you a man. You could have said, hey, bro, you know you're supposed to be wearing a mask or something so like I'm that. Say something to me. This nigga was pointing like a what? child. Like, go oh, get him. Go get him. He's pointing. Go get him. Yeah. Get him. He's I'm going to start mask. coming out with plastic masks. <laughs> well, you can see the air and everything, and I want a motherfucker to tell me he feel comfortable with all that hot air and fog and spit. I'm gonna be blowing up. Like, <laughs> <laughs> no. Mucus, is on that motherfucker. You right. Oh, that winter time, book of juice. <laughs> just, uh, he gonna just take the mask off. No, nah, fuck that. It's a mask mandate. I got on a plastic mask, you so you can see. We see the cloth hide no, all you, the shit that's really on that motherfucker. Right. Get it, make it look like it. Uh, put a whole uh, get a mask that they got mucus and shit on there like a design. Uh, you say mucus? Is yeah. that what you said? Mucus. Okay. Yeah, put okay. on there like a design. You know I what I'm saying? I thought you said your name, Mucus. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, you quick, motherfucker. Nigga talking with his stomach. <laughs> <laughs> From the diamond. <laughs> That's fucked uh. up. I'm sorry, y'all. Yeah, you speak, nigga. <laughs> they say it's moving too much. It sound like oh, a nigga said my shit sound like yeah, a rap battle, right? And I knew exactly. Well, look, just grab a piece right here, man. Look, we do want to. Corey looked like a plus piece. size cross color model. <laughs> Pierre Carrillo, that was very clever. Mm -hmm. He said you, you look, look like a, a down on his look face on love. <laughs> Damn, I look worse than Faison. Y'all some cold motherfuckers. Yeah, Faison. Hey man, hates. Faison cuter than you. Ain't no way. Ain't no fucking way. They call it. They call it. I got your back, Faison. He said I find him more attractive. Yeah. 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 Well, you were talking about the stuff in the mask. It's a, it's Curry, the mom somebody said that's past your spin. Now they're gonna get using that. Wait, they grab you like this. They're gonna say you did it. They're gonna grab you like this. Past your spin. <laughs> well, how about this? This is something else. That, these are little topics that I can't. I read certain shit, and my mind just get to working. I, I want. I, I want to talk about motherfucking um, how people who have never been able to work things out with a partner always complains about what the other partners do instead of saying what they do. I, Corey Holcomb, am a philanderer. Therefore, I'm lonely on holiday. Y'all should never talk that nigga that word. <laughs> That's my word now. That word. As soon as my nigga <laughs> knows, That's the Dre told me that word. That's the nigga As soon as he name. said it, I said, what that mean? <laughs> <laughs> I said, That's dope as fuck. <laughs> That's nigga thought it was a fish at first. Nigga. Now, you are, you uh, the philanderer fish. You are a bojangler. You know your outfit is. But philanderers who gave Corey a shirt. <laughs> <laughs> That was a fadangler. Yeah, a fadangler. A fadangler. A fadangler. A fadangler. A fadangler. 
<laughs> no, look, we got to talk about this because I'm so tired of hearing people talk about what their partner did to them. And most of the time, it is very consistent what all the partners did to you. It's very consistent. When are we, as individuals, going to step up and realize we lonely as fuck because something is wrong with us? I ain't lonely. Yes, you are, though. Huh? I got me so You black. got dressed. You got dressed, didn't you? She ain't nobody dressed you with that, did you? She's a beauty. I got me somebody. You got somebody? Yeah. Oh, somebody new or the same one? She's oh, hanging you know. tough? New, you know what I'm saying? You got a new girl? Yeah, yeah, you got me something new, you know what I'm saying? Uh -oh. I see hesitation. Mm -hmm. oh, uh -oh. See. What city she live in? <laughs> huh? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Number one sign, it ain't gonna work. That's a when you ask a simple question, that nigga said, huh? No, I already knew what time it was. I already knew what time it was. Hey, yo, make it. Like, yeah, they no watch way. the show. Marcus be putting motherfuckers up on shows. If you know Marcus, Marcus tell people about the motherfuckers. Oh, y'all yeah. tell them about the show. Yeah. Marcus get ready to start his own shit while y'all bullshit. Yeah. yeah. Tomorrow, Marcus. man, we earn, baby. We earn yeah. tomorrow. Yeah. You know, what's the name of the show? Mainstream. M-A-N-E stream. Main, like oh, main. big main. Yeah, yeah. big main. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Who on the show with you? Mama. She Marcus right mom is here today, yeah. goddammit. <laughs> hey, Marcus mom, how you doing? Yeah. Marcus mom, cool than a motherfucker. Yeah, she told, she told me, she, 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 she right with you. I told her you like Ooh, the uncle. You scared me. I huh? thought you told him. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Damn. Don't do that. Yeah. Oh. 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 Son. Okay. 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 We doing that. Uh, we doing that. Let me go on call her since you ain't talking to her in a while. Which one? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. 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 Tell that bitch I said call her father. Oh, funky bitch. Jeez, niggas. Tell that funky wow. bitch I said stop acting like a mama. These oh, niggas. Wow. I'm yo. a G with it, dog. You ain't just saying this shit. I wish it was alcohol. <laughs> Oh my God. Funky bitch. <laughs> Come out here acting Hell, crazy bro. with your father. I ain't your boyfriend, bitch. <laughs> I ain't your boyfriend, hey. bitch. Oh. Call You see, I don't talk to your mama. Cole. I ain't talk to your mama. Hello. Oh I don't fuck with her. Call You this close to getting cut off. Oh Cole. my God. What? Don't call a little bitch no more. Ooh. Hey, Ooh. Hey, hey, hey. Ooh. Look. <laughs> Look Will you tell this motherfucker I got a problem with the world? <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, be talking to my lady like that. <laughs> that oh, my lady. <laughs> <laughs> no, oh, but uh, that nigga. Oh. As a panel, uh, is it anybody up here who's come to the revelation? Like, Marcus say he got somebody new. Okay, that's she cool. Hey. You've been, been doing a good job so far. Month, three months, six months? What? No, 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 no. We buy. I've been by about a month and a half. You claiming a no, month? I ain't saying we're together. Yeah. No, I'm just saying found, she's doing a good job. Nice, right. <laughs> I found this found somebody that understand me a little bit. He, Hell yeah. He's down know, with your program, huh, Mark? You're down with the program. You're down with the program. Did you have that outfit on when you met him? Huh? Nah, I'll, you know, I'll be fresh to death. They be sharing nah. clothes. You told me. Y'all see that? She his height. No, she is sheikin' at the Baptist Church. They be sharing clothes. Nah, man. I think that's. I think that's dope. Marcus says she understand them, and that is tough. Hard to do. Right. Yeah. That is tough. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Mm. Oh. I, was, I was just like, they ain't not gonna watch this shit. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> oh, it's a white girl. Nah, <laughs> nah, 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 I don't play that. I don't play that shit. Y'all nah, baby still be dog skin. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what you see, hey, man? That nigga, uh, uh, that nigga uh, Craig made the bodybuilder. Uh, <laughs> hey, 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 <laughs> nah, she be doing push ups with Craig hey, on her back. Hey, <laughs> Hey Marcus, when you go to restaurants, you take your own meat with you, nigga. <laughs> Shut your ass. <laughs> I got some beef in the car. Hold on. Uh, I think I think uh, I think I might got one, man. See? She she's solid. The thing is, you know everybody be lying in the beginning, so it's like. I gotta wait around. It's to new. That's solid. why yeah. people have What's to wait. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You just yes. got a solid three hundred. Solid what? Oh, brother, you ain't never seen me with nothing big, bro. You don't know. You ain't who, never seen me with nothing You don't know who your woman is until she catch you with another woman. That's yeah. when you find out who your woman is. Oh, my is. God. I'm not Wait, disagreeing what? with that. I'm you don't sorry. know who she oh, is. I'm what sorry. What sorry. I'm when you have a woman. What if you tell her about the other bitches and she, and she like, all right, she take it to the well, chair. No, no, we no, not going to no. introduce her and see what happens. Telling, telling her about another woman is different yeah. than when you... And another woman that you fucking with and her is in a room together. Mm -hmm. That's what I say. If you can oh, introduce you like do the then we have not a threesome. Just introduce them. You have really introduced people that it's not to be avoided. Look, this is who this is, and and you who this is. Now look, goddammit, we need each other. Mm. <laughs> now you see how yeah. Dolly laughing at that. Yeah. Back in my day, I, 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 I had yeah. situations like that back in my day. <laughs> Darlene what? is still thinking. <laughs> That all these niggas fucked up out here. Yeah, no, I never said that. I just, listen, I own up to everything, and I've never hated any guy that when something didn't work out, I don't take it out on them. I own it, and I say, showed me what was up, and I'm just, I'm just moving on. That's it. I'm just being fair. I don't want to stick around with somebody where I'm going to be bitching and complaining about something. You had to no, make a decision like that recently? Yes. Darlene is bullshit. Yeah, yes, whatever. Darlene, every woman here we go. Out, here we go with the envious. Every woman out there in America has stayed around a nigga because the thought of him being happy elsewhere nope. destroys their sleep. That's what he would love to just believe in and think, yeah. Darlene back in the no. streets, by the way, y'all. Uh, Not in the streets. I wouldn't put it that way. Uh... What happened to the homie? I would rather not talk about it right now. We talking about, about our business. We talking about our business. We talking about my business. I just, I just told Darlene. you I ain't been shit until the last three months. Darlene don't think that she ain't shit. Darlene I didn't say mean, that. It probably was Darlene's fault. No, it was not. <laughs> you I found you a nigga with a ponytail. No, no. It, as a matter of fact, it the was nigga not. Was on, the nigga was playing video games, and that made him mad. It was something. not. Not at all. <laughs> it, as a matter of fact, he doesn't even play video games. He didn't play video games He was like too much anime. <laughs> no, nope, not that either. No, no. He just felt the need to lie when he wanted to go do something that he loved to do, which I knew about. Oh, no, that nigga had other bitches? No, not no, that I know that that He didn't look like the type of nigga who right. had other bitches. Too Strip club. Right. No. no. <laughs> so why, are you, why would you be mad at him, Darlene? Because you called him in a lie. <sighs> That's why I, I don't like when women be mad at me because you call me. Okay, <laughs> bitch, you called me. Uh, yeah. You're not supposed you, you to telling me you ain't never lied to me? We should be You're celebrating your to ability to, no, to catch that's me in a lie. We should be celebrating you, not condemning me. No, How about it's that? Not yeah. Yeah. Nonsense. Yeah, you good, I mean, baby. You Let's nonsense. celebrate. You the traitor for trying to investigate so much. Nonsense. You no, say it again, Mom. You the traitor for trying to investigate so much. You went against the grain. You ain't supposed to be doing that much investigating. I did not. You ain't supposed to be nowhere you ain't supposed to be. That's the thing, Mark. Because I don't do that. I didn't investigate. I didn't have to. The you shit didn't have was to just, No. It was his fault for being such a bad liar. What Damn. the hell did he do so? Because you said it wasn't no Damn. other way. Ain't no nigga walked Sorry, into his own lie. She oh. investigated no, the I lie. Didn't. Right. That's what all the women do. I right. swear to God, I did not have I to. I leave his phone on the no. bed on purpose just like that when I had oh, this show. It was a yeah, fact but he's of the not looking for anything hey. serious like that, I so ain't he even don't care. I lie to you. Recently... And I, I was at a girl's crib. I did crib. not have to investigate. This I, shit was I woke up and my text messages was wide open and it wasn't nothing but nudes. When somebody said to me nudes and the girl didn't say nothing. That bitch needed some help. I think she went, like, <laughs> I think she went through my phone, but I don't know. The next day she didn't say nothing. She 
was more on her shit, and I was like, oh, she saw it as competition. I like the spirit of competition. Yeah. I will. So I will. You find out there's another bitch, you, f- that's, you feel like. That's the type of chick. I'm she earned about right points there. with me. I was like, oh, shit. She, 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 I will contend all the men up <laughs> here. Look, do not know how to pick a woman that's going to take care of them for the rest of their life. I, would, I, I feel like every man up here is not capable of picking a lifetime partner. And I would advise you against getting married, Ryan. That's his business. It's going to take time for me to figure out who would, it, like, if... If it would, yeah. yeah. Because I'm still learning myself. I might not be a one-woman man. No, Craig, oh, no, I... Craig and me had a talk the other day. Yeah. And I don't, I don't <laughs> want to put, put it on blast. <laughs> but <laughs> Craig... I got Craig, what, I got you about 10 years? No, nah, more than, I'm 39. Oh, 39, yeah. Well, Damn, Craig was, I got Craig by a lot, Craig too. Craig was trying to sell you that. I forgot Craig was still in his 30s. Shit. No, he was trying to tell me this acne shit 39. he said he be using. I'm like, that shit ain't working. <laughs> hey, it's funny. You, like, whenever I talk about my life, I'm looking at the comment section. What this whole thing is about? What? Envy. All right. these jealous see, niggas. See, see. They hear about the there life that I got, these women, and Hunting. these niggas. Yeah. That's why they tune in to the they show for so, envy. Yeah, they just Niggas who watch the show. Us. Corey, my friend. <laughs> I mean, like, what the fuck is happening? What don't I know? These what, what's up with Donnie? So you get, did you get mad at him because of the life or because of what he did? <laughs> well, what happened was. Because he didn't obey. That's what? why women yeah. leave you. That's yeah. the if you don't shit. do what they say, they're going to leave you. Yeah. That's his, don't you that's know his, that by that's now? His that's heart what it is. Talking. That's, that's what it is. That's his broken heart. She talk. said that's broken heart. Nah. Trust me. No. All women a woman have will fuck control. with you for years. Yeah. Then when she finally comes to the determination, this nigga is no. not going to do what I want him to do. Not right. necessarily. I'm not gone. me, no. No. Mm-mm. Nope. Nope. Uh, they, I was they, with women have an issue with years, 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 believe me, there the was beginning. a lot of times where I thought yeah. something, but they I didn't. They try to compromise a little bit in the beginning, and then, then they realize, like, man, nigga, what? You know what? I can't Everybody this does shit. in the beginning. You this don't know each other well. This nigga ain't going to, he ain't going to be in for me. Uh, I've been the that. same nigga for motherfucking 40 yeah. years. Uh, uh, <laughs> same yeah. nigga. Listen, you gotta know yeah, what bitch you got to know. Yeah, bitch got an excuse. No, stop you, fucking with you me. You ain't the same. You was a lot smaller. Don't lie and say what you got. No. No, I'm saying, like. I didn't have to look, believe me. That, that's a diabetes break. But look. <laughs> don't worry about it, daughter. Don't pee on yourself, man. Do what you got to do, man. That nigga been, been, been drinking that Metamucil. That nigga, that nigga he, he already peed before he get to the stool. That nigga holding that dick hard as hell. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, man. DJ Kelly. No, no, no. Y'all motherfuckers, y'all younger than me, nigga. Yeah. I'm telling y'all niggas, you don't know how to pick a woman that got your back. You want me to tell you how you get a woman that really got your back? Who's she telling you. us? Tell Who's going to tell us? Tell Who's going to tell us? pick you. Say it again, Mark. She pick you. Let me tell you something. <laughs> you might me. stumble across a girl <laughs> who show you shit you ain't never seen before. Where you be like, if this motherfucker ain't got my back, ain't nobody got my back. Right. That's your best chance at seeing a motherfucker who do something different than all the rest of the girls. <laughs> That's the situation I'm in right now. But it ain't been about a That's month or something. So I'm saying she I picked know. me. Oh, she, hey, she hey, teaching hey. him how to read, nigga. Just. <laughs> <laughs> girl who got you like that after a month. It takes years. That's sweet, though. That's cool. Craig, I think that's sweet. You get it to me, you're going to be Craig Facts. Uh, I'll give you like that. I think that's sweet, though, Marcus. That's good. What do you think is sweet, D? For him to be all giddy like that over something. He wants you to be set up. Huh? Wait, well, no, I do not. She wants you to fall for a motherfucker that's running game on you, uh, Marcus. Why would I want but that? But she, 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 it's, it's not true. I don't know how she she, she feeling about because she, she, she kind of back and forth about this because she know I told her, look up. You time. wait, wait. <laughs> now these are facts. What you about to say? Yeah. What you told her? Give yeah, it time, yeah. Marcus. Go. Give it time. Go. I said, look here. Uh-oh. I'm polygamous. You know what I'm saying? She I'm, didn't know I'm what po- you were saying. I'm polyamorous. Oh. Huh? The nigga said I'm a idiot. She said I'm a Democrat. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a idiot. I pull a ligament. <laughs> I pull a ligament. <laughs> 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 
Well, you, you, you got to text bitches well, what you, you think. You better hit her back again and make sure she understands. That bitch think you hurt, dog. <laughs> she think you hurt. She think you hurt, nigga. He's not the girl. He's, he's I'm a pulling a ligament. <laughs> he's a pulling ligament. Remember he said, she thought you said, you pulled a ligament. <laughs> Don't talk to her that much, Mark. Uh, y'all hate our best. Learn sign language. That's funny as fuck with D explaining it to me. I wish I had This nigga told a bitch that he, he tried to tell her that he's a polygamist. But he told the bitch he pulled a ligament. I pulled a ligament, okay? I pulled a ligament, right? Glory out there. <laughs> oh, God. Hell no. Nah. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Lord. Hey, man, look. I'm speaking from an old, bitter nigga point of view. Oh. Y'all ain't got to listen to me, uh-huh. goddammit. It, 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 it was a while you meet somebody oh. who oh. got somebody who stayed with him. Oh, man. It was a while. But it don't really happen that much. And y'all entertainers, you don't have the capacity to tolerate a woman talking to you too long because you're an entertainer. What a bitch gonna tell you? What a bitch gonna tell you? Don't you know it damages you to be out here on these stages and shit? <laughs> the shit you just see the makes it very hard for an average bitch to pull you and cuff you for help. Yo, y'all don't understand how true. What the fuck he just said? We are yeah. damaged, man. Yo, you know, he don't know she damaged, but she damaged. So he, dated, he dated a motherfucking rock star, nigga. Yeah. Came up with a motherfucker who came from nothing. Got a house yeah, out there on the hill. Yeah. Ponytail. <laughs> he did that. Everybody know the nigga. <laughs> and he gone. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye. D is hurt, dog. You think I don't know it? He loves to just believe that. He, what? Wants, he wants to believe that so bad. He just wants, you know, misery likes company. That's D is hurt, dog. That's only that's only one way to really. My know. wife gone, nigga. There it is. You think I ain't hurt? <laughs> I don't there's, want there's the only, bitch, but it hurt. There's only one way to really know. <laughs> we D, know you gay. D. D. You gay that don't. I'm hurt. Oh, oh wait, on. there's only one way to what? know for real. Yo, hey. For real, what? Do you watch SVU? No. You hurt. Hey, no, no. That's the best show. How can't TV. you root for the only nigga? <laughs> the only nigga on TV. <laughs> that, the only nigga on TV to get to use his real voice. Hey, I don't want to hear no. after watch. Ice T. Ice T. You. You watch SVU by hey. accident. Nigga. Ice T. Be on TV on. like this. I was like it when he was that that. Right. 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 Ice T. Be on TV. Yo, we're launching investigation. Who wait? You know what I mean? He talk like a man. No, it's all the only nigga on TV who talk like a man. Oh. And you I don't be, watch the next. I swear to God, how I unsupportive think, I think can you be? Hurt, I, 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 like I see him. It's just a curse. I see him everywhere <laughs> I turn. Like I can't even get away. It's, it's Yo, awful. It's, it's awful. Insane. I don't just, know I don't nobody who don't watch or haven't been I watching as we It's been, been on 20 years. years. I, I, Y'all want to see me make D mad? I don't watch it now. I ain't saying nothing. This ain't nothing that should make her mad. But she finna get mad. D. Here we go. He loves to do D. this. He wants me to be so mad and sad. Go ahead. I kill Pookie. <laughs> <laughs> My dick is hard. Yeah. Oh, you watch New Jack so City. Huh? I, I want to shoot set. you so bad. Hello. And his eyes was blinking when he said it. My dick's hard. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I have personal footage, by the way, of that entire film. I was the only person allowed on there to record. And Y'all was the only ones with cameras back then. Y'all was getting it. <laughs> they used to be rich, nigga. Uh, Very, yeah, that is Wesley true. Wesley Snipes wasn't rich like that, that then. That is true. Did no, he wasn't. That he, was, that, he was beginning. That's what I'm saying. He was a great actor, but he wasn't rich. Y'all was the motherfuckers on set who really had it. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all and Mario Van People. Do you keep that money? No, I didn't sue him on it. I did did something bigger and better for my kid. I didn't want to do certain things to his dad. Yeah. Oh, you said you ain't sue him. You you gonna sue him? Once I figured out that he wasn't uh, keeping his his word, sure. Oh, damn. I didn't do, I didn't go paper route. I didn't do it. You signed the prenup? No, I didn't do any of that. No. Well, you know what? We can mm-hmm. give D credit for that. 
No paper route, like she said. Okay. I know the paper's on the way. <laughs> yeah, you, for you, yeah. yeah, nah. Oh. Nah, nah, nah that was some real hating. solid shit, though. But you that's why he hate. I already know this. Yeah, People you still. That ain't why yeah, I hate them. All bitches that I have fucked with it's, have crossed me. It's one of the yeah. oldest things. But talk book. about what I did. Misery and all I do, company. the only thing I ever did was fuck other bitches. That's the only thing I'm guilty yeah. of. Yeah. Wait on two It boys. really, <laughs> they don't care about that <laughs> shit. That be us that be bad at that. See? Uh, see? They, they don't get, yeah. yeah, women don't get. You got too big for a quarter. Yeah. yeah. I did. Thank I you, did. Cole. <laughs> I don't look like I look when I was young. Because they get big, too. So that ain't even, nah, ain't nobody using that. No. Look at, look at uh-huh. him. Yeah. You don't like that. You don't like what that. do you mean you don't like that? No, Nigga, it ain't like... never been. The, it, listen, the reason I'm fat because life is good. Yeah, it is. That's, that's the a good only one. reason I'm uh, fat. That's nigga. some genetic shit you got <laughs> going on. That's medical. You never hold on, hold on. So your dad I was thin. I didn't get fat until I was about thirty years old. Is Show me a fat? skinny picture. Is your daddy fat? Plenty. Is my daddy fat? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You could tell when somebody, was a, with your when somebody nah, was a child all the way up to about four, you fifteen. Why can they shit? Them jeans hit late, nigga. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. Listen. Listen. And you guys haven't nah, been yeah. hit mid age. Why did y'all see y'all it found a way to stop him from finding the skinny picture? Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> I don't want to see it. Oh, His shit. head was still the same size. Nah. I refused to believe. You still, got about, you still got about 20 years, Marcus, and then that stuff is going to, your metabolism's going to slow me? hell down. Yeah. It happens to my guys. Metabolism, my metabolism did right so well. But, I, but, but, can you I, but I kept working out. But in 20 more years. That motherfucker say my child yeah. and your yeah, yeah, my child. <laughs> <laughs> Hurt like a motherfucker. Nigga <laughs> 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 say my child and your rhythm. What the fuck, nigga? God, I can't lie. Oh, God. <laughs> we gonna get you that thing, them people who like this baby. Marcus, how are you? <laughs> <laughs> Can you do? Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, this nigga uh, is about to spend the last uh, hour of the show. Yeah. Because <laughs> no, I, I, I ain't been right skinny. Right yeah, but I, I'm telling you, I'll show you. You got to get saved as an hour. We got to put skinny days. Watch, yeah. Watch yeah. you see the picture that he going to say to skinny. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you yeah. got a picture. I see the picture of oh, skinny. I've been, trust me, I was, I was skinny. Okay, yeah. I want to see it. We yeah. all they need to show kids Fuck pictures. yeah, I tell you, I swear too much for my metabolism. Oh, I know that. I know that. I know that turtleneck wet to the motherfucker up under there, boy. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't got no sleeves on. Yeah. Right. <laughs> go, go, gadget, go. <laughs> Uh, no, it is sharp though. I like it, Marcus. Right, I, I appreciate it. Sharp. I they got, they got that I'm Rambo true. vest on. Mm. Oh yeah, that motherfucking meat packer vest. Getting <laughs> <laughs> punch in the dead cat. Adrian. Oh goddamn. He's thinking of what? Look. He's like, wow. Yeah. Shirt same color as face. <laughs> Corey dressed like Super Mario, nigga. Like, Super Mario. Yeah. Game colors, man. Super Mario yeah, still yeah, ain't forever. <laughs> <laughs> you know that hat stank like a motherfucker oh, under there, Mark. Yeah. <laughs> Your mama laughs. She be in the house. Oh. Leave them hats outside with the shoe. <laughs> <laughs> you dress like you sell fun houses, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> the bump, the bump, the bounce. What them call them motherfuckers? The bouncing houses, nigga. <laughs> I, I don't know. I tried to yeah, laugh at it. You, yeah, you don't know what that is because you, you don't know how to bounce. <laughs> All right, so. Yeah. Listen, Craig has a life jacket on. Craig has a what? A life, a life jacket on. Oh, God. Hey, McFly. You look like McFly when he was over them people houses. Wow, whoa. What happened? Did you find the skinny picture? Look, I can't see his face. I used to be super skinny. Oh. Which one is you? That's in the second Oh, line. you're a dirt bag, Very bro. Very funny. Don't do my whole like that. Hey, that. That's me, nigga. This That's nigga. Easily. That's if I'm lying, yeah. if I'm lying, I'm dying. This nigga got on the shirt in the picture. that Ernie walk around the house in on Ernie and Bert. Man, that I swear to God. Cool, that ain't even right. That's that nigga's that shadow. That is that him. Nigga. nigga, that's me. That's me. <laughs> yeah. And I'm grown in these pictures. Get the yeah, fuck like, out of here. You a child. What's going on? Look at it. Send that picture to the people. Is that you? Hey, send that picture to the people, please. Man, I'm sending no pictures. <laughs> Y'all see this picture, boy. It's about to be on. Yeah, nah, man. I'm this is exciting. 
Always was skinny, where? bro. I was skinny. Oh, I got fat. Comedy, fast. no comedy. I got Wait, fat. Wait, where is he skinny on that picture? What do you mean? Uh, where is am it? I skinny oh, on that picture? Not his hair. Get the fuck I out of here. Skinny than yeah. a motherfucker. Let me see I it. Told his hair still the same size, though. <laughs> Marcus, you what? lost your hairline at right. 14. Stop <laughs> talking about my past. <laughs> and it's true, because I heard your mama say, eh. Yeah, <laughs> but see, she Listen, when mama laughed, you already know I'm oh. telling the truth. <laughs> nigga, a thyroid she rubbed some infamil on that motherfucker to hope it grow back. Oh, God. Nah, man, I was skinny my whole life. And when I got into comedy, you know what it was? I used to play basketball all the time. That's stop hooping. I stop it's hooping. It's too dangerous at a certain age. Stop hooping. You can't eat in and get hurt. Yeah. You just start dunking uh, food up there. Yeah. Look at this one. Now, I want to start playing again, man, but uh, you know you get so out of shape, nigga, everything be hurting and what shit. What position did you play? Nah, I'm always point guard. You play ball point. Yeah. That nigga played bitch. I cannot. Man, listen, Marcus, <laughs> you don't even like sports, nigga. Oh, I, would, oh, so if, no. I would hate to see Marcus on a basketball court. Oh, I'm still cross This you know. nigga probably don't own sneakers. He gonna play in them <laughs> right there, nigga. That nigga Marcus was one of them don't male have on shorts and two loaves of bread on his feet. <laughs> he was a male cheerleader for University of Arkansas. <laughs> <laughs> Marcus was out there. Let's go! <laughs> Both of y'all gonna run down to the tennis bag. Do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They kicked I, Marcus off the team. The coach was like, "Listen, we can't, when I, can't do it. We can't keep." When I got in the comedy, dry cleaning y'all these shirts. Good for two points. When I got <laughs> in, <laughs> never run down the court but once. Yeah, <laughs> when I got in the comedy and I got fat, it fucked everybody up who knew me growing up. But my like most people who know me from comedy, they only know me fat. So whenever I say that, I used to be scared. But no, no, this is the funniest shit I got to say about Ryan. On everything I love, man, I saw Ryan at the beach in a sweatshirt. Yeah. That's when I knew yeah. there's something wrong with that I'm nigga. Right insecure. <laughs> insecure. This nigga was sitting at the beach in a lawn chair yeah. with a sweatshirt on yeah. in the wow. summertime. Nigga, it was cold out there. It was not the summertime. It was cold. Wasn't cold out there. Was you was at the beach. Shit me, it was cold out there. Was it cold out there? Marcus' mama didn't have on no sweatshirt. Marcus' mama don't need no sweatshirt. Right? Cause she my age and she a woman. <laughs> Yo, I, I told you that, boy. You got to accept the fact we older than you, Marcus. <laughs> what you Stay in a child place, nigga. <laughs> what did Marcus say? Hey, Yo, what did he say? Uh, so, no, he said, "Why are you looking at what so, my mama got on?" And I told him, "We the same age, Marcus. It's okay." <laughs> Uh, you gotta come to the, you gotta come to the narrative. Your mom is attractive. When it's just you, my friend. Good, boy, if you wasn't my friend, boy. <laughs> Hey, when we supposed to be doing that Chicago show? Oh, look at James. That nigga changed. That nigga changed. That nigga changed. This summer. It's on subject. We're yeah, yeah, yeah. doing we Chicago doing this summer? summer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why, nigga, fuck the bike? shit out of my door. <laughs> That's what that bitch needs some real dick up in her. Oh, yeah. my God. That goof ass nigga she was with was doing something wrong. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Run game, oh, yeah. Nah, people Use don't realize this comedy. Like yeah, the reason I've, the, yeah, the reason that I've been losing weight some or been you able lost to maintain, weight. Don't do this. <laughs> so <laughs> the reason I've been able <laughs> to lose weight it, man. or at least maintain it is when I had yeah. a real conversation with Corey, man, and Corey was something. The, the road people don't understand. You, if mm. you stay in that hotel all day and Oof. don't do nothing but eat. And then go to go the club. Shop, the, yeah, go. And then the and the club, the food and alcohol is free. So you doing that over and up, man? You'd be surprised what it'll do to you, make you in a two too, years span. Y'all both got. Oh, oh my God! <laughs> <laughs> nah, this Jesus. is nah, no, Marcus. This is called headliner oh, nose. Oh, yours is got, yours is, oh, 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 Marcus, this is oh, called headliner oh, nose. Oh, yeah. You get hey, one of these when people actually want to come see you. <laughs> Marcus, when was the last time you worked out? Uh, uh, when was the last time you worked out, Marcus? He's not like that either. He doesn't say anything. When was the last time you worked out? Oh, I do miss the home workouts every day. Every well, day? why are you still sweating? Huh? Well, <laughs> I be working out when I ain't working out. You ain't worked out in at least an hour and a half. I seen you, it's been an hour and a half. You I ain't sweating. Take that coat off and show your armpits. I'm sweating, man. Don't even play yourself. That motherfucker look like a porno under there. <laughs> 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 what would you say, nigga? Porno street. Right, this nigga got porno armpits. Do you shave your arm here? 
I've I been starting doing that. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, that nigga look like Nigerian porn under there. Oh, God. I will fuck the shit out of you, bitch. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, fuck it. We're going to really slow the show down and oh, get to a part yes. of the show that I don't know how we live through it. How <laughs> we live through us. God geez. damn, it's about to slow everything down. Ladies and gentlemen, these, these loose talk, talk about, about bullshit. Uh, first of all, before I begin, I'd like to... Water? You know what? Do you know what water tastes like? Is this there? So yeah. That was good. Somebody <laughs> said I sweat all jus. Really? Yeah. Oh, that's that's hilarious. hilarious. That's, that's, pork flavored that's water. funny. You're going to steal that one. Hell yeah. Um, anyway, before I begin, I wanted to uh, apologize for not celebrating last week. It was our 12th year, guys, last Tuesday, the, the 18th. January 18th, yep, 2010, one of the longest running uh, shows. Mm. Now they call them podcasts. Back then we were on Sirius XM for three and a half years. Yeah. Before uh, Corey was gracious enough to buy everything and move the show on his own. So congratulations or happy anniversary to us. Happy anniversary. I yes. clapped to y'all, but everybody else was like, years. Yeah. 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 everybody else was like, hey, yeah. so. I, 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 I think that's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody throw me one of them yeah. waters. The 18th, huh? Greatest, Greatest podcast, podcast in, the in the history. Look at you, see? Yeah. Yeah. There's 5150. There you go, see? Yeah, yeah. yeah. see? ain't even close. <laughs> 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 uh, it's, yeah. <laughs> yeah. We need to come out with a podcast. Because I can't really think of one that's they ain't yeah. gonna give me no podcast award. Yeah. I, I be talking about. I be yeah, talking about. Better, too if you, heavy. If yeah, you dress yeah. better, Corey, oh, be, it's too it's too be good. Anyway, so thank you guys. Wallet you wearing? I want to get this out the way in the beginning. Um, not out, not get it out the way, but just want to do it now and then move on to you know other things. Um, our condolences to Regina King and Ian Alexander Sr. Uh, for their loss of their 26-year-old son, Ian, Ian Alexander Jr. Um, and also, again, would like to, maybe we'll put it up later, just, just because, you guys, I mean, we should um, promote the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline. Also, nowadays, things have gotten so serious and heavy. Uh, it's happening a lot more. So unfortunate um, that they even, they have a text not line, a text now that you can send to somebody if you're ever you know, in need of speaking to someone. So you can actually text 741, which is the crisis text line for suicide prevention, and then just put the word strength in the bottom and, um, and somebody will call you or text you back immediately. So just want to give our condolences. Hold on. Anybody out there thinking of killing themselves, will you please send us an email with your picture and we'll let you know what to do after. Oh my God. Oh, hell. <laughs> anyway, I can't. I can't. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah. Wait, what? What? That's what I'm saying. What are you I doing? Yeah, what, what do you do? Get all what? this COVID out of here and all this shit, man. We need to worry about them people, not the people trying to off themselves. If you're trying to off yourself, motherfucker, goddammit, go get some COVID checks. Yo, <laughs> the views yeah. of Corey Holcomb do not, not thank you. <laughs> represent uh, the thoughts of, of Ryan Davis. Yeah. Hey, or listen, Darwin. I can't yeah. speak for y'all. That's but true. I, I just do that. Not with me, exactly. <laughs> that nigga cold-blooded, man. man. You, no. see, you see who Mouth came out of. Yeah. Well, y'all niggas scared. <laughs> yeah. Y'all want to laugh at a nigga who off they self? Nigga who off they oh, self? I got a suicide joke in my set right now, so I can't nigga, I you can't off do yourself, it. nigga, just don't fuck up. That's what I tell a nigga. Get it done. We, we want to We want to have our motherfucking respect for you and get the fuck on. If you're going to off yourself, all this shit out here, we up against all this shit out here, and you're going to off yourself, and we supposed to be like, oh, my God, this is a problem. Mm. You, we still trying to survive. You trying to go. Yeah. I'm just saying, dog, if you off yourself, you off yourself. Yeah. Guess what? All you bitches who can't stand me, I ain't going to never off myself. <laughs> you got to wait it out. Literally. You got to hope something happens. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. okay. You got to wait it out. So, uh, <laughs> change things up quite a bit. Uh, congratulations <laughs> to Cardi B, who just won a $1.25 in damages in her defamation case 
against YouTube blogger named Tasha K. Tasha K. In wit and she's got a huge following, that Tasha K. Uh, so she has the money, and uh, which she calls a malicious uh, campaign that Tasha K. did against her to hurt the superstar's God, reputation. The case just ended yesterday, um, the 24th. The jury sided with Cardi B and agreed with her. Um, so she was awarded that amount, and it could end up by the end of the in two weeks, it could end up being even larger than that. So wait, Cardi B won a lawsuit against against the regular looking bitch. A uh, YouTube Tasha K. That bitch got a Ryan nose. Um, well, Tasha K. put out. That bitch do got a Ryan nose. <laughs> anyway, Tasha K. When she talked, does she sound like Ryan? <laughs> nah, she don't sound congested. Go ahead. What Tasha stupid. K. say? Uh, what she the bitch put say? out. If if those that don't follow the story or didn't know about it, she had put out over a dozen videos that contain some pretty. Uh, Shocking claims about the rapper. Um, both women testified on their own behalf in the two-week trial. Uh, Cardi B told the court that only an evil person could do that kind of shit. Uh, she won for defamation. It can be granted more uh, for the liability of invasion of her privacy, um, saying that it was betrayal in a false light and intentionally inflicting emotional distress. So she's so, actually going to probably get more. Who is um, the NFL face bitch? All right, so you you already know this is kind of my lane. Her name's Tasha K. Uh, so Tasha you know K. Well, nah, she has I've over a million followers. But, she uh, a nah, she um she's on YouTube. She got over a million uh, mm -hmm. followers. Somebody Actually, said the bitch got a boosy face. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> so I, the reason I knew her so well, knew of her so well, because when the Derrick Jackson shit, she was the one who. Spilled the beans on the that Derrick Jackson true. nigga. Who was Derrick Jackson? It was the Preacher relationship, nigga. the relationship uh, guru. Suck ass that, nigga walk around and the bitch got her security on in the house. <laughs> got the nigga naked. <laughs> Niggas be up a whole house. They don't even know. They get set up the whole time. Yeah, right. she she was bringing girls on the. Oh, I know I'm set up. It, them tapes she, coming yeah, out. Yeah, y'all gonna she see my dick up. So now she's <laughs> really good though. She's really good with having like receipts with you know what to I mean show stuff, right? to show stuff. But this happened in 2019, and maybe she wasn't on her shit like she was supposed to. Well, that they said that she didn't prove it in court. They, yeah. She didn't have any of the stuff she claimed. To. So, she, so she just was envious of Cardi B. Yeah, and, and said and went one. after her heart. You heard, you heard all this, all you goof ass niggas who claim you know me, who who say my name all the time. All you sucker ass niggas who be saying my name, it's just I done did the research on you motherfuckers. Uh, yeah. These niggas is broke than a motherfucker who going yeah. through my show. These niggas at yeah. work putting shit on the shelf talking about, hey, how y'all doing? I'm like, what the <laughs> fuck is this? This nigga is at work with a cell phone talking about he got a show saying my name. Yeah, you she... can't even sue these bust ass niggas. Mm. And I need a bitch like that who gets some money to talk shit about me so I can motherfucking go after them for that face. These busted niggas sitting in the house talking about Corey, my friend. Yeah, she She's said, uh, she said Cardi was a prostitute. She said all oh, kinds of stuff. She said she had is, certain diseases. She yeah, didn't say she, she thought. She didn't, she didn't say, say, yeah. say she thought. She didn't say allegedly. None of that. She, she didn't say yeah. rumor has it. She, she was said saying that shit like it was bomb. fact. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. She said that the bitch got her. Yeah, yeah she was saying she a was lot saying of shit. She don't got her? No. Cardi B ain't got her. No, man, come oh, on, bro. Here we go. Well, you next. Almost all, right. all the strippers got hurt. Right. But look, Cardi already not, done showed yep, you what it is. Yeah. I didn't say the bitch got hurt. No, what I'm saying is it's just, you know, you yeah, she yeah, obviously yeah. don't like when people say stuff matter Well, no, here's with. the thing now. In all fairness, she did give her an opportunity to remove the content. They they oh, asked her. So she you know did that. a cease and desist? They, no, they have. Yep, they actually, Damn. she personally asked her she to said remove that she the stuff. What's your girl Tasha, name again? And they did it, Tasha K. So, and Tasha she K so. is about to motherfucking have her accounts purged on and be out here trying to make it looking like that. <laughs> She's married yeah, and she over, has bro. an older child too. I'm so surprised. Yeah, it's it's, it's over. When, you say she's married. I, I don't care how well you're doing on YouTube. One point one That's point it. two five. Man. That hurts. That they, hurts. They said a it's lot. gonna get bigger because the other ones it's haven't going, been granted. Right. She it's, hasn't been granted the other two children. She's gonna so. be paying Cardi B the rest of her goddamn life. Mm. And that's fucked up that you got to look. That lawsuit coming with that big ass. This is going back to the beginning of the show. <laughs> bitches okay. who look like that are always the bitches fighting at the club. Arguing in the grocery stores. It ain't bad bitches do not really be having problems because they always be like, <laughs> that's below me. Right. But all you bitches who work in convenience actually, stores. Actually, have there ever been a beautiful gossip column woman? I don't know. I'm trying to think. Oprah. 
Oprah. Have you ever seen a bad bitch do the gossip column shit? Man, this nigga go, man. Ricky Lake had a show. That's a bad white bitch. She wasn't a gossip person. Oprah is playing in the motherfucking NFC Championship this week. Craig think Wendy Williams is bad bitch. That's what I'm saying is Wendy. <laughs> was there ever a prominent gossiping woman who was through his fine? Uh, 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 Ryan has asked a very uh, good question. Do you know an attractive woman who is in the gossip column game making it big time? They all look like the bitch right there. <laughs> that bitch looked like an Olympic sprinter. A male, a Jamaican male. Right. <laughs> <laughs> that bitch looked like Tyrone Hill when he made that touchdown this week. That motherfucker. Oh, the peace side. Oh, what's his name? Hill? The motherfucker uh, who played for yeah, Kansas that City? Yeah, motherfucker fast, boy. <laughs> Man, Come on, Jim Hill. Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> nah, Jim Hill was I fucking this. Hey, Jim Sorry, Hill, Hill. Hey, Jim Hill, me and you was fucking this one bitch together, boy. That bitch said you made what? her take that wig. I mean, you wouldn't let her take that wig off. I was wrong. <laughs> bitch tried to take the wig off. Jim you Hill mean was together like, oh, you mean together or the, the same woman? Off. Huh? We was fucking the same bitch. You said together. Not together. Uh, not the okay. shit you be just, on. No, just being, yeah. oh, just being clear, Corey. Just being clear for Yo, you. See how you try to help a friend out? You gay out? every week. You see this? You, you, see you gay this? every exactly. week on here. This I'm gay. I have to be some, yeah, this one right here. Misery <laughs> likes company. He don't want to be alone. Yeah. Darlene thinks she ain't gay because they she let them eat her pussy. Oh, God. Here we go again. Wishing. It's only gay. I would come. never do that. Wish but you can, star, you can never have, do what never you want to do. Never have, never will. With your taint talk. My God. Tank talk. They said Claudia Jordan and Angela Corey's Yee tank look talk, good. Corey's tank talk. <laughs> Angela, Angela Yee, I don't Corey's know. Corey's booty talk. That's not really gossiping. What they I heard you, Craig. Like I don't have no yeah, answer. Yeah. I'm just saying they said Claudia Jordan and Angela Yee. Well, we got to say this about Claudia because I like Claudia. But Claudia, if she ain't suing somebody, somebody's suing her. <laughs> oh, really? Have you ever thought about that? Oh, and really? I like Claudia, but I'm like, I, didn't know I be wanting to doesn't. tell Claudia, just cool out, Claudia. Right. Claudia, do you know Claudia Jordan was motherfucking a Price is Right girl? A was Price she? is yeah. Right girl. Oh, we, oh wait a second. Up. I just watched a Joe video. She was the video girl in Joe's video. I think I want to know the I want to know video. Claudia Jordan is mm, yeah. extremely mm. attractive, yeah. but I be like, what happened to that? Like, not trying to talk shit. I'm just saying, she, if she ain't suing somebody, she's being sued. I be like, God damn, Claudia, what the fuck? I never heard of her being sued, so I don't know. You, mm. you, 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 you attractive. All you got to do is show up, and the world going to take care of you. Right. Yeah. You got to, all you women out there who are attractive, and you ain't on your feet. Listen, you got to stop believing the person you want you can have. You got to pick the motherfuckers to choose you. I know a bitch right now. It's this elderly man. He got a lot of money, and he want to marry her. And she won't marry him because she don't like him. I was like, that is the dumbest fucking thing in the world. Does she man, deal with him? Huh? Does she deal with him? She don't. She, she work with him, but she won't fuck with him. I'm like, are you crazy? She at least fuck with him. That's they what I'm saying. Him, nigga, fuck with him. That's the one thing that's I learned about L.A. Nah, that's the one thing I learned about L.A. Women who were hot in like the 90s or was like a bad chick in the 90s, they don't really know when they time be up. If they're in the When is a bad bitch time up, though? If you really a bad bitch, do your time ever be up? No, yeah, yeah no, it's, it's never. They talk about the age, you come when they get old. Or when they age with a out the game, maybe age out the game. Bad bitches don't age out the game. No, they don't. Right. Not, a, not I'm talking about a real bad she. bitch. <laughs> not these fake cute bitches. His the bitches out here, you the think they cute. Until you wake up with them in the morning and they coughing. So, uh, yeah. And they're coughing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, be the motherfucker that mix, that, that mix with white, that get older and then that milk spoil. Yeah. No, but I'm talking about. I've never heard I'm not that talking one, about. Well, see, my level of <laughs> bad bitch is different than the next. No, no, no. They level. really be. No, no, no. But they really be bad. But this is what I'm saying. That you can get you a, a NBA All Star or a Pro Bowl football that nigga with a big contract. You ain't in your twenties no more. You you gotta get you a nigga that do real estate. Right. Real estate, <laughs> boy. You gotta well, get. If you a bad bitch, like you just gotta play your lane. Some yeah. bad bitches still getting young niggas though. It oh. is, and the richest niggas. Yeah, but they don't breadwinner in that situation. Oh. <laughs> 
Huh? Right. They be the breadwinner. Your hunt game is with. on today. Yeah. Uh, hold on. It's a, it's That's your second hunt that was hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I seen a nigga. That was young and had, was an, young, older had an older chick. And he was the breadwinner. Shit, the white well, boy from okay. Punk. Okay, she, he might have. The white boy from Punk that married Demi Moore. Usher was fucking chilly, right? Uh, Demi Moore ain't uh, no what? bad bitch. We yeah, know Chili ain't got, got no a, money. He, yeah, she was huh? cold when he had her. Chili them ain't got no money. <laughs> right, you're right. And getting down with somebody totally different. He, they, being a Chili drive couple. Uber, don't you? Shit, Ray J had uh, Whitney Houston. Man, y'all got to stop but, that, yo. But sleeping with somebody <laughs> Ray J is me. a motherfucking oh hustler, yeah, nigga. Oh. That's when he was on his hustle game, dog. Mm. Did you see Whitney the night it went bad? Man. And this was years after. They weren't even together and she was fighting with that. That lady. night, so that sad. night it went bad. Whitney was, so was looking sad. bad out there trying to fight the little young girl. <laughs> that night it went bad for Whitney. And we ain't root on that. Because no. we like Whitney, goddammit. Even, even when she couldn't sing like she used to. Right. We like Whitney. Love but that love night her. outside the club wasn't a good look for her. Right. <laughs> that bitch was out there on her motherfucking Wendy Williams side of the game shit. That was sad. Damn, I'm trying. It's somebody anyway, I okay. see one. Can't think of it. Go ahead. You, that's why you See, can't think of it, because so it's hard. So, yeah. You might find one or two, but oh, I'm just yeah, saying, yeah, yeah. Oh, bad yeah, bitches point. find a spot in the game. Yeah. It's the bitches that fake being cute. They years run up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, they, theirs run completely out. When you're bad, it never runs completely out. You'll always be able to get you. Yeah, uh, Felicia Rashad. Uh, Lisa, forever, forever nah, but you'll always get a nigga who can sit, who sit the bench. You'll always get a nigga Angela who. Angela Bassett. You'll but, always get a showrunner or a producer. Angela Bassett is nice a star. Is that's, different. That's what I'm saying. She keep Them herself up. Yeah. Who? Angela Bassett. Angela Bassett keep oh, yeah. herself she, up. Mm. She's still in shape she's and all that. We talk that's about. Crazy. Hold on. First of all, a sixty-year-old bitch is done. Normally, normally they done. Yeah, yeah normally. Oh still. my God. Angela. This one. Angela's still going. You know, Angela Bassett is different. I can tell she yeah. get up every morning, be on that motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> Angela Bassett yeah. keeping her shit straight. Yeah. Ass is fine in the motherfucker. Yeah. The Javon Darden, you're correct. Right. Regina King, too. Yeah, yeah hell yeah. Angela yeah. don't look like she's nowhere years. near that motherfucker. Oh. She'll be 80 in 15 in, in years. In 15 years, oh. Angela will be Angela Bassett. How old is she now? She's 65. Do y'all know that for a fact? Y'all gonna get sued like that ugly bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Not about age. That's yeah, good. Long 50 sure. something. How old is Angela Bassett? 63. You about to get a 63. In that age. Oh, nah, she's it's usually pretty close. Yeah, you say you what, uh, 63 on the <laughs> 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 We went to high school, Bill Cosby. <laughs> Nigga, I'm, 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 I'm 60 so with you. I'm proud of that. Got that different world ass. Man, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you what's crazy about Angela Bassett, how fine Angela Bassett is. You know, uh, what's love got to do with it, right? Mm -hmm. Who's, I keep forgetting her name, that played her mama. She's like everybody's know, auntie. Nah. She plays everybody uh, mama. Oh, you, you, you yeah. ain't talking about uh from Moesha? No, 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 no. Marcus, mm -mm. Marcus, before you say the name, y'all, y'all know who I'm talking about at the crib. <laughs> she's on Blackish. <laughs> she's on Blackish. She's uh. I did, I did, I did. I worked I, with I her know before. who you're talking yeah. about. I'm trying to remember her yeah. name. Jennifer, Jennifer Lewis. Lewis. Yes. Jennifer Lewis. I read it. So Jennifer great. Lewis. Played Angela Bassett's mom and what's love and got to do with it? And they the same age. What? Jennifer Lewis is one year older than her. And still Jennifer Lewis though. got a voice like a nation of Islam preacher. Yeah, <laughs> what you need to do. Uh, Great book, by the way, you yeah, guys. Especially if you want to do Audible, because she reads it and it's like. A oh, you should have told me that I just. J-Lo. Hey, you didn't get it? No. Boy, she ain't gonna fall off till she die. Oh my god. I'll buy some more credits. J-Lo ain't gonna fall off till she die. Please do it. So that's the bad bitch you came up with, J-Lo. J-Lo, bad motherfucker. I ain't say nothing about what night. How she yeah. look? What I'm saying? She's still making them young niggas. The that's the one you came up with. She still be getting some young niggas. A lot of bitches with paper kids. Alicia Keys a bad motherfucker too now. Alicia Keys. Eddie Murphy's ex-wife. Going to Tiffany. Look good still, man. Man, this is the deal, man. When I take a bad bitch. But she be, but she be, <laughs> she be bad bitch. Yes. That nigga said Queen oh, Latifah. Oh, yeah. No, no, AJ Johnson. No, Brad a bad motherfucker. You know what, bad bitch? Mama, AJ the bitch Johnson. The bitch who was giving, um, yeah. uh, the bitch who was uh, at the end of Color Purple doing the dish with, uh, 
<laughs> What's the bitch name? Oh, Zobi we'll, saying Q. Just don't make uh, the sound. Oh, Whoopi Goldberg. Goldberg. Whoopi Goldberg. The bitch at the end who was doing this with Whoopi Goldberg. Remember yeah. when she said, eh, eh, eh. <laughs> Remember she tried to hug it at the end. I said, Dad, this bitch just did a turn. Selma Hyatt still looks good. Yes, go Selma. Selma Hyatt got a big ass face, though. Yes. I love to get in the argument. You're because Spanish. You ain't saying that for good. nobody else. You picked the Spanish good. bitch. No, you said, said J-Lo, nigga. Thank you, man. <laughs> you said J-Lo, too. You said, no, I didn't. No, I did not. Sure I couldn't you. think of one you African did. American woman. You and everything, yo. Boy, they just reach for a star, kid. Hey, 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 white bitch, you be writing shit about us. Right, Marcus couldn't say nothing about an African American woman. He couldn't think of one. That's a man. Marcus like a light. Now, that's a good one. Pam Grill. Ooh. Nigga, you don't even know Pam Grill how she looked. Why you used to watch with that movie? She had them titties out. Oh, he talking about when she was younger. Before you were born, Ooh. her ass bitch. Yeah, I was young. I, I used to catch it. <laughs> <laughs> I used to catch yeah, anyway. Hell yeah, I used to catch it. Pam Grill looked just like the Pink Panther to me. Uh-huh. But when she was young, I was Pink man. Panther. The Pink Panther, the cartoon. The who, actual who Pink like? Panther. I wasn't, dun, 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 I wasn't dun, dun. a big Pam Grill person, yeah, but I would have fucked Miss Parker for sure. Pam Grill cold. Yeah, oh. when she was Miss Parker, she was cold to me. Mm-hmm. But for the most part, nah, I wasn't a big Pam Grill <laughs> person. Uh, Kelly Rowland fine to me, though. Kelly Rowland? Kelly? Yeah. I remember Kelly, Kelly, Kelly Rowland Kelly, came Kelly, a while Kelly, and out and was saying, Kelly, Kelly. don't curse because I'm a Christian. <laughs> really? <laughs> On anything I love. And out. She tried to control the whole show? She tried to control the whole show. Are you sure it was her and not the other one? Because the other the one's dark religi- bitch. The other one's real Shit. religious, right? Before the nose Michelle, job. Michelle That's is real religious. Brandy. I don't mm-hmm. think. Say it was my Kelly. name, bitch. <laughs> you sure it was Kelly? Leave alone. This nigga. What? I I smash, but I had them smash while I'm while I'm getting dressed up. <laughs> bitch. Anyway, all right, moving on. Uh, I love leaving a bitch out looking at him like. <laughs> so um, I wasn't going to bring this up look, last week, but <clears throat> since she brought it up on a show last night or the other night, um, I was going to address the Tiffany Haddish. Uh, she finally addressed her DUI bust last night when she was on the Tonight Show with Jimmy Fallon. And she actually made a very clever, cute joke out of it all. He said, was it all right? And you know, those kind of shows that they, they pre-check beforehand, oh, you know, shit. what you want to talk Tiffany about. Looking nice. She looks great, by the way. She's shit. doing all kinds of now. She Corey said, so actually, she me, made a cute joke out of what it. He was being supposed to plug me with her, man. I she was looking for a German Shepherd? She ain't trying to make <laughs> She ain't trying to make it. Anyway, so she was willing to speak about it. She said, uh, they asked her, is it okay? And she said, yeah. She said, you know, I've been asking God for a new man in my life. And he answered my prayers. But it seems that he might have overcompensated and gave me more than, she, than I could handle for it. Instead, one man, she said, he, gave, he blessed me with four men in uniform. <laughs> <laughs> so like she it. made a cute joke <laughs> about the whole good thing. Job, nice, good chuckle about it. Um, she said, hey, I got a good lawyer and they're dealing with this. And of course, the... Um, it, not for nothing. I'm not giving, you know, an excuse or anything like that. But just FYI, she had been going through a lot lately. You know, she lost a lot of friends and family. Um, to death or, or she yeah, just cut them off? Yeah, and she even, um, they, they pulled her over for suspicion of weed in case everybody's interested. They're not, she wasn't drinking or what have you. Um, but she lost a lot of people in a short amount of time, including her grandmother, um, her dog, a longtime producer friend, and of course, Bob Saget, who she called her mentor. And she actually did a really nice tribute to him the night before actually so the morning of that she was it was affecting her pretty heavily hey, man, um, these niggas ain't shit in this damn chat oh room. nigga i seen bob saget tell a crazy so if you, you, you watch that tribute that she did to him it's pretty touching and she did that hours before the arrest so. rest in peace bob saget tiffany you're gonna be the you're the next oprah and i want to be steadman <laughs> oh my god. I live in the back house. Yeah. Just give me a this shot. A really sweet girl, man. Right? These niggas ain't shit. They she say she looked like skin. like back to uh Eritrea. Yeah. yeah. To her, 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 to her, her father's village. uh village, yeah. dressed like a deck of Uno cards. I heard that. That was though. touching. I like that too. She that was so great. she grew her hair back? 
Uh, you can't grow know. a hat back, Marcus. I think <laughs> <laughs> you say can't grow a hat back. <laughs> hat back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we wish you much, much success, friend. Uh, Tuck your belly in, Corey. To the fifty one fifty family, it ain't Tiffany. Your fault, man. <laughs> wish you the best. Um, also moving on, of course. I've Tiffany been the homie for real, yeah, though. Yes, she is. If yeah, everybody, yeah, everybody, solid, man. Tiffany the homie. Better when I first got down here, she was hosting. And um, yeah, we wish her the best, and I'm pretty sure all that's gonna be gonna be work, worked out. Uh, of course, I've been waiting for this one. That's why I have the Janet Jackson shirt on, and my nice little tribute to you know her in the '80s jacket. Um, her Janet Jackson's uh, two-part docu series starts Friday. I can't wait. It'll um, air. It's the only one that'll air simultaneously on both Lifetime and A and E Friday and Saturday night. Um, of course, it's called Janet, and it's a two-night celebration. Also, she's celebrating the 40th anniversary of Control. Um, it contains star-studded interviews, exclusive footage that has never been seen before of the Jacksons, um, of course, her when she was younger, and also gives great detail on her family, including all the stuff with Mike. Um, her we'll talk about how she divorced that dude the day she was out of that contract. You never know. <laughs> she could. I don't know. It's, it's, How's she, that pussy, Janet? <laughs> Is that a recent picture of her right there? That's yeah. that's the advertising. She's still board. holding, boy. Yeah. That's the She's advertising. She's still board. holding, boy. Oh, that's a picture, boy. Oh, it's a picture, mm -hmm. yeah. You know what? <laughs> it's Photoshop. Then it got big as me, boy. Yeah. No, she yeah. ain't. <laughs> anyway, I, like, control. She's, not. <laughs> She's always kind of carrying something around her face. She's she looks great. She's always had a round face, though. That See, so yeah, that so makes it. She thin. face really round with cheekbones. She's a cute BBW right now, but she got really prominent you cheekbones that makes her face round. Yeah, yeah. But little penny when she. That's one of my. That's a regret of mine that I never saw her in concert. Oh, I just did. This shirt is from her, 2017. The 2017 yep. concert Hollywood came Ball. I should have went. She ain't performing Woo! no more? Hey, man, you see she them pictures? Not, them them pictures in black. But that's, that's one. That's I'm telling you, I seen I a picture of Janet. Ooh, Janet got that weight on her now. Yeah. Yeah. Janet look like I think she'll perform. Uh, you talking about she your side. You'll be able to see that. Yeah, hey, boy, let me tell you something. It started in the neck. Airbrushing is a motherfucker, boy. Here we go. Here we go. They got some yeah. pictures of food and shit out of you. I'd yeah. see some headshots. You want to see Ryan look handsome? Oh, man, yeah. <laughs> I can't believe Boy, I got a nigga that'll make Ryan look like motherfucking yeah. uh, yeah. uh, Nat King Cole. Uh, yeah. <laughs> you you man, chestnuts roasted. Yeah. You might Corey, be talking about Muhammad. Corey, always some of Exactly. Yeah, you might be talking about Muhammad. Because he did that you. He did pay. <laughs> Fuck you, Mark. <laughs> Somebody back there cracking up. Anyway, congratulations to one of my favorite first basemen and designated hitters of all time, Big Poppy David Ortiz. Oh my God. Legendary Boston Red Sox player is now officially, as of last night, and if you see the video, it's so touching when he got the call, is now in, in um, it, he'll be uh, in the Baseball Hall of Fame at now, as far as Barry Bonds and Roger Clemens, they were both denied for their 10th and final time so they can never apply again. Who won't translate his speech? Very is funny. That nigga English? Barry Bonds anyway, is stupid. <laughs> yeah. Them, because to be honest And Roger you, Clemens, because both of them were. Yeah. Hey, man, Barry terrorists. Bonds was a Hall of Famer before all that motherfucking Thank shit you. came out. Thank he you. He was the best player in baseball. Yep. They taken away from him because he was black and them records won't be broke. And he definitely better than Big Poppy. Yes. Barry Bonds was the best player in baseball for he years. He's the best yes. player in the baseball history. I will yes. not argue with that. Yes. Yes. Barry Bonds was the best player in baseball history. history. Roger Clemens was a was a motherfucking mm -hmm. steroid freak. Yeah. Even when he was even when he was young, he was all right. <laughs> but he he stayed afloat yeah. off them steroids. Barry Bonds was been hitting that ball even when he was skinny. Yeah, right. That's true. That motherfucker that true. took racist ass Pittsburgh to the playoffs, and that's why I won <laughs> shit. No, nah, that's that's true though, man. All of his mostly all of his accolades came well before yeah. the steroid the uh, uh, scandals hit. Yeah. Mm. yeah, they just wanted to throw him in there, and they ran him out of baseball early. He should have waited. The man was a monster. He, he had an eye for that ball, yeah, and then true. did the. 10 he got an years. eye for balls, man. That's true. He should have waited. But, and they, you can use steroids all day, <laughs> though. You can use steroids <laughs> all day, but it don't help you hit the hit ball. Barry got an eye for ball. Yeah. He's a, he and Barry was going to get into it. That's true. At the motherfucking uh, New David Edition Ortiz. concert. That nigga pulled your zipper Me down. Me too. And, <laughs> and if you guys, if it, you guys forget. And you, know, and you know who came over there? Two years ago. My, my nigga Joe Coy. <laughs> 
Comedian Joe Coy came over to Corey. I love Joe Coy. I love him. Y'all niggas don't know. Barry Bonds had a bitch sitting next to me, and he came over there and stood in between, and it was crowded. I was like, hey, hey, man. You know what I'm saying? (laughs) You know at the Foxhole when he was there or no? Because no. Uh, Barry came a couple times at our show on the Foxhole. Oh, I, I ain't never seen Barry at our show. Not our show. The, right after when we all went to the field. You went to the Foxhole. Yes, you know what's up with the Foxhole, God yeah. damn it. Barry, mm-hmm. Barry like balls. Gosh darn hey. it. Hey. Yeah. Fox Hole had that irregular shit going on up there. Anyway, last bit. Uh, Antonio <laughs> Brown, it just came out that he was, he was on TV last night. He was on, uh, what's homeboy's name? The, the, the HBO, oh God, what's his name? Bryant Gumbel. Bryant anyway, Gumbel. he was on Bryant Gumbel's show and he was with his lawyer, there he is, and he said that he, um, that the Bucks offered him 200,000 to go to the crazy house so that it can support the team's claims that he's mentally unwell when he did his <laughs> sh- side wheel show. So he Why said- Why they offer him 200,000? Did paper get low or something? They were hoping. They were hoping that he would t- and, and, and go so that he would, you know, after that meltdown, they claim that he was uh, mentally ill. Anyway, um, uh, so he's, he's just, did, of course, refuting that. Mm-hmm. Hey man, Antonio is Brown good. is the crazy homie. Yeah. That's the crazy homie. Is he crazy? Yeah. Come on, man, the man crazy, man. Yeah. Remember when Mike Tomlin was motherfucking giving his little speech? That nigga had him on live. Like uh, uh, <laughs> yeah, he did. Okay, that nigga ain't shit yeah, that, in the bro. locker room. In the locker room. That's kind man. of that's like. And, and, okay. and, and, and this one dude said, if you can't get along with Mike, Mike Tomlin, motherfucker, then something he wrong. He a player's coach, yeah. Right. Oof, and Mike they went at it. Mike Tomlin, people forget Mike Tomlin got that job as a head coach when he was like 34. Mm. Never had a losing season. Never had a losing season. That's why he's the only black NFL head coach. Now that that's last. cold-blooded. Yeah. Damn. And the standard is, if you lose, you out. This is the crazy part. They One time they were having a bad record, and people were like, was well, it time to get rid of him? Damn, he he, <gasps> ain't, he can't have one bad season. Right. No, that's uh. This nigga has never had a losing season. Hey, white bitch. What's the white bitch name? <laughs> Which one? What, D, your friend. I'm not talking. You can Why help you be yourself. Scared to say her name? I'm not scared. I'm just not on your same page. You scared of the bitch? You whatever. Hey, print Corey. that. Print <laughs> that. Whatever. White lady. <laughs> wow, man. Okay, okay, Tasha K. <laughs> Tasha K. Who is that? You. The girl in Cardi B suit. Uh, 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 sue Cardi. me, white bitch. <laughs> I ain't got no money. <laughs> I don't know why these motherfuckers think they can sue yeah. me. That don't scare me. I ain't in Hollywood. I ain't getting the shit put up my nose. I'm straight. <laughs> Go call your editor and see can you pass the story again, you bum ass bitch. Man, it's some fat niggas in 5150 Nation, nigga. You say some we fat gotta niggas? redo the shirt. Show? We used to I'm gonna tell you how they know. I, know. I gotta show you the shirt. Because niggas. Say no is, again. This is how I know. <laughs> so, this nigga sing when he say no. Nah, I'm gonna tell you how I know. That nigga yeah. said that from his diaphragm. Yeah. 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 No. No. Nigga snored a little bit. <laughs> this is how I know it's fat no. niggas on there. Because they looking at my facial expression that can tell I'm hungry. Yeah. So, that's how I know these <laughs> niggas have been through this that. This nigga is the best in self degradation. Yeah. <laughs> really, this is clever shit. I be peeping the game. Yeah. You know? You got to be a fat nigga to see my facial expression and go, and I, go I know what that is. That's hunger. That's hunger well, right I have, there. Well, I have chicken taquitos over there. Oh, I'm going to eat them too. And chicken um, uh, yeah. tortilla soup. <laughs> I'm a, I'm I'm a man of God, so I can't be worried about all <laughs> that. Oh, like a oh, motherfucker. Poor God, you're you a bad die. PR yeah. for him. You're I'm, I'm, I'm a better man of God than any of y'all up here. Oh, my little man. Whoa. Especially you, D. You be quiet. Whoa. Now he's lying. Whoa. Wow. Whoa. Okay. Now you, now you ain't you know never been God, God don't you claim now, you don't oh, please. <laughs> cool. Closer to God than you. I made that nigga over Did you hear what she said? That's already a sin. Closer to God than me. Mm-hmm. That whatever. is a sin for you to say that. Whatever. You a heathen. <laughs> God whatever. said you was a leftover. A leftover. <laughs> <laughs> well, God wore that Philander. coat. Philander. going to motherfuckers. Yeah. Philander. Put the oceans together. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you don't get that motherfucker. <laughs> I like that jacket, man. And they say, I know you waiting on a joke, but it ain't coming. And I, I, I did like too. I had to tell him, you gotta Every get the truth. Every time he start walking, that Lionel Richie music come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Which one? We were running with the night. <laughs> <laughs> he had to pick that one. Taste the rainbow ass jacket you got on. Give me a slip here. Dressed like he only eat candy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> God, I didn't catch it. Mitos, the fresh maker. Look at that, nigga.
All right, so D, you done? Yes. All right, D. Wow, um, thank you for asking. We got Craig facts here, so we got to come up with a motherfucking beat. You dig what I'm saying? Mark is going to rap at his motherfucking um, Martian. Smooth when I move. Heat hat. Heat hat. Heat you going you gonna, you gonna, you gonna to rap or something, right? Nah, not on the empty stomach. Uh, we gonna we gonna get you. He need a wrap before he rap. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I need a turkey, a chicken wrap or something. That nigga, <laughs> I need a wrap. That nigga, be, like, wrap. Like, that nigga be like, give me a wrap with a bun in it. Yeah, <laughs> nigga. <laughs> Don't yeah. this nigga want a Big Mac wrap? <laughs> I, need, I need something. I need something, nigga. But nigga, blood sugar low. <laughs> <laughs> I got some extra snacks over there, right? Yeah, yeah. You brought some food. I did. Yeah. I did. Yeah. Only because I, I, oh, I was gonna overeat and I couldn't. I we'll get to him after this. All right, so we gonna take a quick break. No more than five minutes. We got to get this beat together quick because um, we don't want my nigga to motherfucker have no uh, diabetic coma. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I brought it like, I couldn't even fake it no more, nigga. That nigga peed for 10 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> that stream was weak as hell. Ain't nothing come out that motherfucker. Nigga, <laughs> <laughs> The toilet was like, nigga, what's wrong with you? <laughs> you gotta be, you gotta be a different kind of nigga to listen to a nigga pee. <laughs> what are you drinking, Greg? Nigga, nigga pissed milk. What are you them drinking? Niggas, them niggas was listening. They were like, what man, you got in y'all some gay niggas. They were like, I wonder if his dick out yet. <laughs> what is it? Ginger. Oh, I thought it was horchata. Cayenne, pepper, water. But I mean, it looked like horchata. Turmeric. And does, protein. Uh, this nigga got some oxy wash in that motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I can't lie. Hey man, we'll be right back. 5150. <laughs> oh,
Fifty One Motherfucker Fifty is back. Talking shit on a brand new track. Coming up with this shit and by the stack. Uh, I hope shit don't be whack. God damn it. You know what I'm saying? Uh, uh huh. We are here in beautiful Pasadena. Is this Altadena or Pasadena? Pasadena. Don't even. Pasadena. Yeah. At the motherfucking Coin Academy. These motherfuckers coming up in here. They got this motherfucking screen like Beautiful. on the real yeah. TV shows and shit. It's incredible, goddamn. This is the home of the baller podcast, mm -hmm. goddamn. The motherfuckers was nice enough to open the doors and let the 5150 come in here and talk this shit. Mm -hmm. um, Y'all know how it go, man. We motherfucking be coming up with motherfucking little bullshit tracks and hooks. Between the show during the breaks and shit. Um, then we motherfucking attempt to rap. Marcus got about 14 words he just stored in his mind. <laughs> he about to come with the motherfuckers and shit. Y'all know how it go. Go like this. Give me that beat, goddammit. about to talk about something that can't be denied. It's in that nigga's eyes when he look at you. It's called envy. Want what I got? Hate me for no reason. Envy. Why they want what I got? They hate me for no reason. Envy. Why they want what I got? Nigga hate me for no reason. Envy. Why they want what I got? Envy. I'm gonna start it off. These niggas can't stand my ass. Hey. Even though I make them laugh, they be on the internet stealing all my shit. Bitch ass nigga, why don't you quit? You're not my friend. And I don't watch your show. I just get that shit and I go and try to be nice about the whole thing. But that hate you gon' bring. Envy. Why you want what I got? They hate me for why no you reason. Envy. Why you want what I got? Hate me for no reason. Envy. Why you want what I got? Nigga, hate me for no reason. Envy. Why you want what I got? Envy, envy. Craig, what up? Why you want it when it's mine? Feeling bad that you got left way behind. Why you acting like you blind? Acting like a bitch when the world is mine. Why you acting like you nine? Child is in the brain and dead inside. Why you acting like you fly? Trying to be like me when I'm really that guy. Yeah. Why you want what I got? Yeah. That envy Why you happening is that envy. Why you want what I got? For no reason. Envy. Why you want what I got? Nigga hate me for no reason. Envy. Why you want what I got? Envy. Envy. Marcus, go ahead. Why you want what I got? <laughs> you try taking my spot. Till I ran in your spot. And the bullets was hot. Uh, then a the nigga got popped. Hey. Uh, then I ran to the lot. Uh, then I hit another block. Yeah, nigga, I'm out. Ryan is hungry. <laughs> that nigga ain't during the break. He hungry. Anyone what I got? He ate <laughs> during the break. He hungry. Anyone what I got? I'm he not. ate something during the break. He hungry. And he gonna drink it with pop. Hey, he hey. gonna drink it with Look. pop. <laughs> Ryan on the show right now. Oh, Move to Carolina D and how? And D took care we, of me. <laughs> we about to bow down and let the flow go through the show. I want you to know that this fat ass hoe I be fucking got on my phone. And when she called the bitches that I'm fucking too, this is what the funky bitch decided to do. She Ooh. sent a text to me naked in the bed. Show that dick. Bitch, I ain't scared. Envy. Why you want what I got? Envy for no, no reason. Envy. Why you want what I got? Bitches hate me for no reason. Envy. Why you want what I got? Why you hate me for no reason? Somebody go on next and wreck this motherfucker. Put it in check. Yeah. It be like Marcus is mean. Uh -oh. Hey, this thing a ling I swing. Hey, I'm the two line king. Hey, I hit your hold and swing. Hey, about the house. Hey, then I run up to the couch. Marcus will and not put fail. That code it was on sale. <laughs> Envy. Why you want what I got? It, it, 
Jimmy, 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 yeah, and the world is yours, but you're too busy hating because your girl is poor. Marcus is country. <laughs> <laughs> musty for no reason. He country. I he called him the cop. Got. Nigga, musty <laughs> for no reason. He country. And he sleep in the cop. <laughs> Nigga, musty for no reason. Country. And he'll kill you for country. Yeah. <laughs> I'm from Arkansas. I call it just like a thot. <laughs> What'd he say? Corey dressed like a thigh. <laughs> they say Corey dressed like a thigh. <laughs> but you niggas, I don't care. Marcus <laughs> ain't got no hair. <laughs> <laughs> they pulled that out on beat there. <laughs> Your body is about to pop. <laughs> DKC close to me. I can see. DKC close to me. Can't think of nothing else to say. So we about to let this beat go away. Let outfit is gay. Yeah, Bojangles in the house. A nigga said Ryan's hungry and he don't eat if he not. <laughs> they're good. They're good. Fuck uh, y'all niggas, man. He's <laughs> gonna eat if he not. Everything in the pot. <laughs> <laughs> and the nigga don't stop. <laughs> This right here oh, is the end of the show. I'ma let the homeboys up and flow. Oh. If you got something that you want to plug, I'm laying it out like the red carpet rug. Ooh. Promote everything you do. Craig on the show this week, so. Oh yeah, start man. with you. Uh -huh. Start the with you. Facts podcast. Go to the website. I got a couple new show announcements. I'll be in Seattle at the. Uh, Langston Hughes Theater, only black owned theater in the country. Nigga Very on nice theater. Um, purchased the Chill Withers album, man. I got over two million streams on the album. Let's get another couple of million streams. And that, that Chill Never Withers will be dropping in about a month and a half. It's going to be an NFT attached to it. Make sure you really purchase that and check it out, man. And, the stand up and the music, man, ain't nothing like it out there, I promise you. And if I owe you something, get it from God. God, God, God. <laughs> God, God, God. <laughs> I love that. That's Marcus, the way you dress. <laughs> It's really hard on the eye. <laughs> but you're about to promote your new podcast you about to do. Let the people know that it's gonna be tight like them wallet shoes. <laughs> hey, appreciate everybody. Last week I announced it about at least 500 people came subscribed. You said at least five? Nice. Yeah, go. yeah. Really? I, I appreciate nice. it, man. Everybody that come through and support, man. Y'all left comments and said, man, y'all ready? Y'all can't wait to see it, man. Thank y'all so much, man. We oh, starting tomorrow. Great. Yeah. yeah. Good. Starting tomorrow, 6 o'clock uh, Pacific, uh, 8 o'clock East, uh, no, 8 o'clock Central. Do you want your okay. partner to come on the show and Yeah, see? come on, come yeah, on. Man. It's called oh, Mainstream. Mama, it's, it's called it's what? Mainstream. What is it called again? Mainstream. 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 <laughs> M-A-N-E-S-T-R-E-A-M. -E -E Don't sit in my lap while Mark is Country first in the city. <laughs> ah, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Everybody, Marcus' mom is in the house. I don't know if she's getting shot. Hold on, come on over here a little bit. There she go, hey, 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 <laughs> right there. Right. Say hi right there, man. Yeah. Uh, well, that's going to be my co host right there. Co host, Marcus, yeah. mom is in yeah, there. My co host, man. It's on my YouTube. You know Marcus. Y O U K N O W M A A A C U S. Thank y'all, man. I appreciate y'all coming to subscribe. Go I'm going to be with this nigga this weekend. Happy, bur happy early birthday to you, dog. We're going to be in San Diego. This is Marcus' mom. Her name, Jonay. 
Broke swag. She being shy today. Look, yeah. check it out. She came on the industry repo show one time when we did that. My brother Mark is graduating to the game, just like Craig graduated to the game. Craig, yeah. when he did his podcast, very successful. Man, thank I know you. Mark, his podcast is going to be successful. Y'all finally going to get a chance to meet his mom Yay. on a more talkative type thing. Yeah, appreciate you, know you man. Looking forward to this? Yes. Good. That's what's up. Appreciate she be, you, man. She being shot now, but what? They gonna, they gonna do this stuff. Oh, nah, they gonna say. Yeah, see <laughs> appreciate you, man. I wanna pre- say appreciate you, OG, man, for giving me my wings, man. Come on, man. Yeah, it's not wings, right. man. Yeah. Right. They told me, it, it, we had to sit down today. He was like, man, it's time. It's time. You you, you, you say you ready? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He said, believe, he said you ain't gotta come every week. You know, he was like, you, you can come, you know. Right. Never, well, you know yeah. what I'm saying? People graduate. The 5150 show is here for people to graduate, man. Yeah. Craig graduated. I can't, oh, but I knew Craig was going to go out there and do big things. I said it from the beginning. Mm-hmm. And now, God damn it, you, you, you buy, I know, I know it's going to be a success. I think, I think the uh, um, dynamic with you and your mom stands out because your mom, your homie for real. Yeah. And yeah. that ain't what a lot of people get. So man. this is going to be good. Yeah. No, don't be shot, Janae. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Where that auntie at that was trying to give me some pussy down there in Arkansas? <laughs> oh <my God>. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna come down there, girl. Just hang it down. Oh I'm like that dude on that slow ass horse. Hold on, I'm about to break my record. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's what's up. Uh, Ryan, I know you got some shit you're trying to plug. I want to go so bad. Uh, not really, man. This weekend is my birthday weekend. Yay! Happy birthday, man. Uh, Shit. Yeah, Wait, you're Python? No, we're Aquarius. This is Aquarius oh, season. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So, uh, feral fish. Yeah. Uh-huh. So, you, so, so I'm at uh, your bathtub in Aquarius. Oh, no. <laughs> Stupid. Hey. Y'all do not do not let Corey fool y'all. That nigga yeah. just as fat as me. This nigga. <laughs> you know what though? I'm that like, that's I might be. That I realize that he got big. He's just taller. That nigga just as big. I ain't big. big. No, I ain't big as you. I'm looking at you. Nah, no, 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 no. You just nigga. taller. You just taller, but that scale gonna say the same goddamn oh. thing. No, oh, hell no, no. <laughs> Your neck get that shit good. I ain't even got a neck. Now you yeah. just making up shit. Y'all both uh, 350. <laughs> Yeah. One of y'all might be 345. <laughs> I'm glad you understand. I don't know what he was saying. I thought he was I thought he was doing the auction. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Three for four, three yeah. for four. Yeah. You, you be sounding like a Jesse, you be eating your leftover yeah, when you talk. We heard your leftover. If you talk about your talk. Jesse and not speaking English is not the same thing. Oh, you see. Yes, sir. I want to. Oh, I want. Love What's to happening this week? Anything Slurry. good? You I would wanna... love to go this weekend again. I have a party to attend Saturday for a girlfriend's birthday. All right. And uh, but but check me out on Cameo. You guys, Valentine's Day is coming up. I always get a lot of requests for that, so I would love to um, accommodate you. So check me out on Cameo. And also, I've been making appearances and helping my son out with his Twitch. He just got on it, so it's it's, it's a lot of fun. I don't That's know. It might game, be my right? own thing, but. No, that you could do all kinds of stuff. He does oh, okay. everything on it. Yeah, he goes and hangs out with me and does stuff like that. So we just have a lot of fun. But anyway, uh, check me out on Cameo, and I want to go through so bad in yeah, San Diego because we're doing Thursday, Friday, See? and Saturday. See, and I could do Thursday. Yeah, Maybe I'll do Friday Thursday. on this yeah. Thursday. Yay. Yeah. yeah. Might do that. All right, so check it out. Fifty-one fifty lives again. We gonna win. All you haters, keep trying to dig in. It ain't gonna stop nothing. <laughs> it really ain't. Say, say my name, say my name. That's right. Because I ain't going to say your name. <laughs> you know, you, have you noticed I don't say your name? All, all you people who claim me, say, uh, uh, no, I ain't going to say your name. Mom, you can come sit over here. Just move, no, <laughs> she, she all right, right here, boy. <laughs> she all right, right here, boy. <laughs> I had to run you away, the little young line away from the... Um, <laughs> No, man, I appreciate you been like a good uncle to me. Mama said the other day, man, Corey like a brother to her. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Do your job, baby. Yeah. He's trying, to, trying to stop it from happening. ain't ready. I'm going to come on the podcast and we're going to do a reveal show. Oh. Uh, I am the father, boy. Uh, ain't no way. Ain't no way. You still got your hair. Uh, Ain't no way. Too bad you still ain't got your neck, nigga. I don't know. All right, so. That's right, and check out the hats, guys, in the store. All the hats are up. Marking. 
<laughs> Wait, no. I'm gonna see you a picture one day. Pick you up. Hey, boy, I want you to smash. <laughs> I told her she was easy. Damn. She ain't got no standards, D. That was me who said it. You know, I'm joking. That was D. Here we go. Here we go. She ain't used to a southern nigga. She ain't used to a southern nigga getting on when Marcus come and take his hat off. Ma'am, I just can't. Boy, she's going to be all on that nigga, boy. I know them sheets going to be musty than the motherfucking Marcus. going to be dripping from under his arm on them sheets. All right, so look. 2022, we've been coming a whole nother way, goddammit. And this the way it's gonna stay. We're gonna keep going hard. I can't, like, I, like, I wanna tell y'all, like I said earlier in the show, some of y'all, my niggas out there, I love y'all, man, but it don't always work, you dig? I found that out the hard way. It don't always work. I'ma do what I do for the show. I go off talent. Don't mean you ain't talented. It just don't always work. Don't be mad at me. I gotta do what I gotta do. Keep my product rolling like it's been rolling out here, goddamn. Mama gonna be rolling like DIs, goddamn. You dig what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? All right, so don't forget, Marcus, say the name of the podcast again. Mainstream, M A N E S T R E A M. I ain't gonna be able to cut the folk in the city. That together? Yeah, yeah. Marcus uh, is good post- on his social media, so how can they find it? Yeah, if you can, if you can post my uh, YouTube, across, it's on the screen. Yeah, gonna put it up there. On the screen, you gonna be good, my dude. Yeah, y'all support Marcus in his new ventures in life. Yeah, man, I'm a little nervous dude. about it, man, but you know, let's get it. I'm gonna hey, come yeah. over. I'm gonna come over there and see what's happening, okay. Marcus. Very important though, man. Cause I might I want watch you the to show too. Super successful, man. Make sure you put the subtitles. <laughs> oh my God! Oh, you don't want people. Uh, to, you want people oh, to know six, what the fuck going on. Six p.m. Uh, Pacific. Pacific. Y'all gonna close caption it, Janae. Eight o'clock. Central. They gonna close <laughs> caption it. <laughs> I don't know why mama acting like she ain't country over there. I know she country. That's why she they... ain't talking. She don't want y'all to know she country yet. <laughs> they coming to the show. <laughs> Ooh. You coming down this weekend? I ain't country as you, Mark. You coming down this weekend? Okay. You know Janae be supporting. Oh, my, 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 she she supporting like a motherfucker, but she might have something going on. I don't, a, my, my, I don't know. We'll be down there, nigga. Don't worry about it, nigga. We'll be there. I'm going to come downstairs and watch the show. I'm chilling this weekend. Let's come down, man. Why you want what I got? Come, come down, down, man. Watch It'll Ryan. be no lie. In San Diego? Yeah, See? man. See? At the American Comedy Club. Yeah. I might come down there. All right, bro. I, I ain't gonna lie, it's like it's like 80%. I might make a move. I, see, hey, that's hey, good. Hey, my my, hey, my, my hey, little my little thing coming. My little thing coming. So yeah. I was about to fly something. Your girl coming, Mark? My little thing coming, you know what I'm saying? Why ain't you matter yet, babe? I don't even fuck with that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Why you want what I got? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I love it so quick. Yeah. I love it. Mom, you should stay sit down over there. That nigga got one up on me. I don't the, like it. The show been <laughs> over. I'm just bumping shoulders over here, boy. Hold on, I'm about to break my own record. <laughs> 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 I see that commercial. <laughs> when he riding the fake horse. Right. And the yeah. kid like, let me get a turn. Hold on, I'm about to break my own record. <laughs> But it's going to slow his head. <laughs> <laughs> Indy. What do you want what I got? Feeling <laughs> coming off of Marcus. <laughs> Indy. <laughs> All right. Hey, Coin Academy, thank you once again. Another week of blessings. Yep. We are about this motherfucker. Nigga, go Mac. Macca. Layla. Motherfucking Layla. Coin in the house. Academy. E. They all got that jogging suit Bill Cosby was jogging on on his sick car. Get Go Mac. Uh-huh. Got the song ready? Yeah. Uh, got an intro song been working on, man. Y'all uh-huh. got to let me know what it's about when you see it tomorrow. Busty. <laughs> <laughs> we about 5150, yeah. 5150 Nation, baby. <laughs>